everybody. Welcome to today's stream, D&D Night, and we got everybody here, including someone new. But uh, I'm sure the introductions will come That's as we play. Spoiler! Yeah, her face is on screen right now. Her image is on screen right now, so it's it is what it is. <laughs> it's, it's the same for me as well. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start recording now. All right. Okay. Hello, everybody, and welcome to session twenty of Last Haven. In the last episode, you guys officially defeated. You're fifth the demon. Woo! Yeah. Why are you guys? Why are you guys not even excited? Because we're wow. physically exhausted, and I'm still <laughs> wiping my tears away. I mean, yes. Uh, yeah. The uh, the um, the the demon has died. The Squirrel, the squirrel leader, the squirrel, your father has been resurrected from, from almost from from death. Squirrel dad and, is no uh, longer dead. dead. Yeah, because from death he died. My friend here brought him back. Russians and uh, yeah, blacked out. Yes, and uh, yeah, and Ty has grown a bunch of mushrooms all over his body and has fallen over. <laughs> I can't even speak. I would like to roll a knowledge of nature on the on the mushrooms. Roll nature. I should have opened my character sheet before I said that. Probably would help. That's fine. Come as a house player. That would have helped. We're uh, playing smart today. All right. Well, you rolled a nineteen. Ty, what kind of mushrooms are you? Uh, there are of various types. There's some that are poisonous and some that aren't. Uh, okay. And like and it probably would be actually it would probably be more stuff that was native to the plains where he's from. Yeah. Where Bazal is from. So. so it's like yeah, it's it it a bunch of you have a bunch of mushrooms and a lot of them are glowing with a uh dim blue and purple aura. Anyone else want to do anything else? I've got nothing. Uh, hmm. Give me a sec. I'm gonna roll Arcana. How magical are these? They're very magical. In fact, they are the the they. You could tell that they are. Uh, they're the 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 mat. Uh, Arcana gives you what the school of magic it is. What magic school are you? Uh, primarily, uh, like conjuration. Uh, no, it's primarily necromancy. It's like necromancy, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. The mushroom ones are necromancy. Oh, okay. yeah. So there's a lot of necromatic energy coming off of them. Hmm. Anyone know any holy spells? Fuck no, that would be. Gilbert's actually just gonna walk up and just start poking one. Just poking oh, yes. one of the mushrooms. Uh yeah. Ty. Yes. Uh uh I'm gonna say that once he goes up and starts touching the mushrooms, that's when you are awake. That's when you are jolted awake. Gil goes to poke at one of the mushrooms and Drizal just full just fucking 90 degrees sits up. It's... <sighs> Got some new jewelry on you, huh? Just Oh. Gross. I just kind of brush some of the mushrooms off. And just, I'm okay. Nothing to be worried about? You brush them off and they immediately grow back. Oh, I've now got them just growing off of me now. Great. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to Circle of Spores. Well, yep. Time to uh, time to redraw your after. Fuck! God damn it! Ah, <laughs> oh, you got one. Ah, oh, you got perma shrooms, huh? Uh, 
Hey, at least you at least you get to still sleep. I am a servant of darkness now. I don't know what sleep is. Oh, what I is that growing on you? Uh more importantly, why is it growing on you? And those are mm. oh god, what is the name of those? There's a specific ki kind of fungus that I just thought of. Cordyceps. Ah, um, oh god. So you're a clicker. No. <laughs> it's just. Wait, I'm sorry. Is that a, is that a slur? I don't mean to say that. I'm sorry. You're you're fine. <laughs> They're just mushrooms. Uh, it seems like with that last wither and bloom, my magic decided to change. Um, I'm I still need getting Matt, used to this whole nature thing. I need Matt, Ty, um, yeah, Matt, Ty, and Raven to roll me a, uh, Arcana and Wisdom saving throw. Arcana, Arcana check first, then Wisdom saving throw after. There's my Arcana. Which is only a nine. You want a wisdom save? Yeah. 30 20. Okay. Arcana first. Arcana first. <laughs> well. Yep. Wisdom second. Yep. Just wisdom regular save, wisdom, yeah. not a saving throw. No, regular saving throw. Oh, saving throw. Okay. Yes. Well, okay, oh. critical <laughs> failure. Seven does nothing. <laughs> I mean, critical failure is a critical failure. You rolled an eight, essentially. Yeah. Critical failure. My dad cleaned my room again? Oh, that drives me. That would drive me. <laughs> Where the fuck's my <laughs> face? Meanwhile, uh, Gilbert's just gonna kind of look at the mushrooms, look <laughs> that are growing off of Drizelle, and then look down at the floor at the mushrooms that fell off as he brushed them off. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Shrug, and then just climb up onto his horns. <laughs> you notice that the that mushrooms wonderful. that you notice the mushrooms that are falling off of Ty are. Uh, are immediately dissolving once they touch the ground. Hmm. So they're magical mushrooms. This has been established. So they're I, get magic where I, I get where you're going. <laughs> but, but here's the thing. Found my dice, finally. Okay. So okay. if I pop uh, it off, does it stay in my hand? Matt, you didn't roll a wisdom save. You rolled a regular wisdom. Oh, um, uh, where is that? I mean, oh, right here. There we go. Oh, yeah, okay. it, it would have been the exact same addition because he doesn't have he doesn't have proficiency in wisdom saves. I well, yeah. Uh, okay, so. Uh, I need everyone in Discord to please mute your microphones, and then, and I will have uh, yeah, Red unmute their microphones. Okay, muting. Red, you there? Yes. Okay. You. Enter, you awaken in this realm of fire and brimstone. There is a creature standing over you with another person's body hanging from the ceiling, from their hands, from their wrists. Oh, lovely. Uh, is all my stuff on me? You have everything on you. Cool. Uh, hey, look. A boost there. <laughs> hey, mute your mic. <laughs> um, what is it? What is he bound by? 
uh, large ab abyssal uh, anexium chains. Oh, so not something that can be easily cut. Probably not. Cool. I will put that out there. <laughs> um, she will carefully get up, looking around. She has. Does she have any idea how she got to be here? Uh, your memory of this of this play of of getting to this place is foggy at best. Okay, cool. Uh, so yeah, she will stand up basically and look around, see if there's any clues to what she's doing here. Uh, see if there's a key to maybe she can get this guy down. Well, there's also a person ahead of you, like in front of you, ah, okay. on a throne. Oh, lovely. Cool. Um, oh, let's see. She will... I'm guessing it's this guy right there. Um, uh, yeah, this, this, this guy right here. Cool. Um, oh, I didn't give you control of your token. I'm sorry. Let me oh, start. yeah. Um... So she is instantly on guard, a little wary, because uh, she doesn't know what's going on here. But this guy possibly has answers. So uh, she will keep some distance, but she will go to about there, I guess? Easy talking range. Yeah. And pretty much just uh, who are you? Where is this? I am the one that started this. This is my domain. Mm -hmm. I have brought you here because there is there is another that needs your help. And uh, she disappears. Uh, they well, he, uh, they disappear into like a cloud of smoke, and appear directly in front of you, like 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 within centimeters of your face. There is a definite startle. How big is this guy, by the way? Uh, uh like person, I guess. Six, like six feet, six feet. Cool. So I uh. By the way, I'm seven and a half feet. Um, yeah, so like, but still, still like, uh, meeting your eyes in your at yes. your height. So he's oh, levitating. So they're, they're levitating. Cool. Yeah. Cool. So yeah, definite like jerk startle thing, and she'll she'll take a step back and put a hand up, you know, like distance, dude. Um, and she'll just like, okay, uh, this one here. This one here and disappears into a cloud of smoke and appears next to the one hanging. He, uh, he's about like 10 or 15 feet off the ground at this mm -hmm. point and r reaches over and grabs, grabs his hand and grabs a dagger and rip stabs into the back of his, in the back of his hand and rips out a gem out of his hand. This one here. Didn't make the cut. So you teleport, cut him. teleport down behind you this time, and reaches reaches over and grabs your hand. And when he grabs, when when they grab your hand, you you feel this intense heat and pain appear onto the palm, under the under the top of your hand. Uh, yeah, you're like she will try to take her hand back. Uh, you could roll strength. Like I don't expect to succeed this, but like. Yeah, go ahead. Uh... I, I'll let you roll strength. Oh, fifteen's actually. Oh not wait, bad. why do I have that advantage? Uh, because there's a button that says advantage, normal, and disadvantage on your character sheet. Should be. Uh... Yeah, pop. But I don't have that listed for any of my things, though. You might not have the uh, advantage toggle set 
hit the gear and it'll be right under the gear you should be able to see advantage oh yeah no you're using a different yeah there oh, yeah there it is always roll advantage is Never on roll advantage there we go but you should have a set to ask you should have a set to ask that way you can advantage toggle yeah advantage toggle that way okay, if i tell go. you to roll something with advantage it will just pop, do a pop-up that works okay cool it's done um it but we're gonna your the strength first one huh it beats your strength. Yeah, I, I figured. So, uh, it uh, it's like don't worry, pain is temporary. Solutions are final, and it disappears back into a cloud of smoke. It appears back on its little throne. Hey. Uh. Don't you worry. haven't actually answered anything. Uh. You wanted me to answer questions. Well, unfortunately, you haven't earned that yet. Uh huh. All right. It raises its it raises its hand up, and the body that's hanging from the ceiling slowly gets crushed into a tiny little ball and thrown into the lava. I have no more that's... use for this. <laughs> uh huh. She's by the way. She is looking very confused. Don't worry. Your questions will get answered in time. But for now, you must leave. And it shakes his hand off. It shakes their hand off with like, uh, like, you know, like, be gone. And uh, all of a sudden, the loud, a loud crack happens in a flash of light and you've uh you've been teleported all right everyone unmute your microphones yellow all right uh for who has danger sense? Uh, I think only our barbarian does. <laughs> yeah, Gilbert. All right, Gilbert, you noticed this before anyone else, but um, uh, uh, a loud flash of light and a extremely bright, like circular portal appears. As this, uh, uh, what? Oh, sorry. What race are you? I'm apologizing. Furbolg. A furbolg. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh, as this small, well, no, seven foot. Tall. No, opposite of that. <laughs> this tall, Power tall. Person. What? What? Can you explain what you look like? Um, I am seven and a half feet tall. I've got blue fur. Uh, did there oh, isn't really any description of an actual fur bulg. I'm I'm furry and tall. Okay. And so furry, this this tall robes. This tall furry woodland creature falls out of this portal onto the ground in front of you. In front, and now everyone can also see as well. Well, this is certainly an introduction that is a lot more graceful than I got for the re than for the rest of the party. Oh, Jesus Christ, who are you? Guys, where's Care? Look around. Gil Gilbert's just going to point directly oh, at... Fuck. At the uh, new person's hand, there. 
Oh. Uh, so I rolled against everyone's natural perception, and this thing and this thing won by a long shot. Nobody noticed Kara disappearing. Well, no, but we would know that notice that Kara's Kara is gone. Just you notice Kara's gone now, but you never noticed yeah. Kara yeah. disappearing. Uh, is what I'm saying. Our friend has gone missing. His stone is in that person's hand. I'm drawing a sword. You you don't see that yet. Actually, I'm gonna I'm, I'm before while the sword is drawn, I'm just gonna lower the sword and be like, hold on, hold on. Not going to. I'm uh, yeah, meanwhile... I'm gonna I'm just gonna look at a uh, Drizel and just say, you know, if I was treated with the hospitality that you're about to show. You do not know me. Then I would be I am dead. simply... Here's the thing. I am not attacking. I am simply drawing my weapon to be ready. I did not say I am attacking. Oh, good. Yeah. I'm gonna, not a murder hobo, by the way. Yeah. I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna hold up the hand that has the stone in it on my character, and I'm gonna say good, because this is yours. Yes. I know, and I still don't want it back. Meanwhile, well, they're doing whatever it is they're doing. Um, I am going to, like, just be looking around really fucking confused because I still don't know what happened. She's going to reach out and touch something nearest to her to see if it's actually, you know, sturdy. Does it exist? There's a table next to you. Cool. Yeah, she's putting, like, some pressure with her hand on it and just going, okay, that exists. And then she's just gonna start moving on to things around her. Is like, no, no, this all, this is all real. Okay. Hey, hey, and hey, you, hey, hey. Going on. I, uh, I think the king sent you on a great adventure. We have the same quest in our. We have the same quest right now. I have been told nothing of a quest. So I am semi. So did we just say this to now. everyone? Good luck, kiddo. And Did this I'm king really just sure. drop a new drop us a, a party member and not give them the lowdown? And not to mention the fact that he took care and then dropped us a new person out of nowhere for seemingly. I don't reasons. trust this at all. Yeah, look, as, it feels as, weird. Look, with the with the amount of divine intervention that dude has, I don't even want to question it. He probably was just like, eh, this one sucks. You you get this one instead. Question, uh, question for you, uh, ma'am? Yes. Uh, Siliqua, you may call me CC if you wish. Assuming you don't plan on using that weapon on me. Siliqua, I'm Giselle, and, uh, you seem sensible. I'll just draw my, or not draw my sword, I will sheath my sword. <laughs> uh, draw <laughs> my other sword, no. Um, can you describe <laughs> who it was who... <laughs> What ha what was the last thing you remember before you showed up right here? Person in robes grabbed some gem out of a guy, turned him into a ball, and threw him in lava. Lava, you say? Yeah. That? Not the best first impression I've ever had of somebody. Thank you. That doesn't sound so, like king. So, uh, I... Can 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 I like sneak sneakfully being as tiny as I am, just kind of simply walk over without being noticed and just do do the whole otter thing of you know smells. Is that not a stealth check at that point? Uh, that, that's why I'm asking. The otter wants to pretend to be an otter when they're not. Uh... <laughs> I guess that would just what you want to like smell, smell him. The otter yeah. is being an otter. Yeah, I just want to walk up and t take a big old sniff. Investigation roll with advantage. With advantage, perfect. Yeah, because you're an animal. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is gonna be great. You have a good sense of smell. Wouldn't that I'm be laugh. You roll double ones. Smell, then? No, because perception is like 
it's, it's the scene where said, you're actively yeah. investigating something. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, I get advantage, so there, there's that to counter my negative, too. In, in comes the incoming the double ones. <laughs> right? I mean, 10 is not bad. Um, You can smell sulfur and like really, really, really burny smells. I, I'm just gonna gonna just take take like, like a couple steps Bernard. back. <clears throat> right. So taking a couple steps back, grabbing my snout, and I'm just gonna fucking say hell. And I, I, is it safe to say that she smells similar to when I did when I got knocked out of the portal? Yes. Got it. At least similar. <clears throat> Not the exact same, but similar. Well, yeah. So, so Gilbert, you're saying that they smell like hell or they smell just really bad and you're just swearing now? Sorry, I had to crack that joke. He, he's just gonna I look into like a fucking stupid that in one in one <laughs> syllable sentences. <laughs> he's just gonna no, he's not even gonna say anything. He's just gonna simply look at look at the bird like he's stupid. <laughs> All right. Fair. I feel like when we get back, we're going to need to ask some questions. I have the same feeling. Yeah, just a few. If you yeah. could tell me what is going on here, where I am, and what exactly that thing expects me to do after kidnapping me and killing someone in front of me. Save the Your universe. Question is as good as ours. I or guess. Sorry. I wish we had an answer for you. But it sounds like the person who sent you and the person who sent us are two very different people. Why are you telling At them the trade secrets? I certainly hope they're two different people. Love. I hope so as well. Which brings me back to the question of where are we? Squirrel Village. My squirrel. Uh, apparently where I came from. We just did, we just killed a really big thing, saved my dad, love you by the way, and uh, we're going and we're about to leave and head back to who we report to. I, I'm just gonna, adding to what I said when I said Squirrel Village, I am using my thumb to gesture behind us over here towards the stairs to the set of armed squirrel guards. I thought they were dead. They might be. No. Oh, the armed squirrel corpses. Okay, just a little tad yeah. redirection. The, the bipedal, things. the bipedal squirrels with armor and weapons. <laughs> uh, if you've never seen what these things look like as a full image, um, you'll never, you you never will because apparently I'm not allowed to click on them. Yeah, Roll20 oh, yeah. is like fucking lagging like a son of a bitch. Love to see it. That's what it looks like. Um, and this is okay, what the king she, this is what King she... Squirrel looks like. <laughs> she nods slowly. She's very obviously processing. I think introductions are in order, everyone. As I said, I'm Drizal. And I'm going to let the others introduce themselves. G uh, Gilbert's just kind of like dan dancing around around this new person, just kind of like trying to figure figure out eh, what the fuck. <laughs> well, that's one way to introduce yourself. Yeah. That's I'm Gilbert. an otter! Leave me alone! <laughs> I have um, limited I, Siliqui, Siliqui seems not at all disturbed at the small creature making a fuss around her. What did you say the name was dance, again? The dancing otter Siliqui. with the great sword sheathed on its back. 
big man, shut up. What did you say your name was again? <laughs> uh, Siloquay. You may call no. me CC if you wish. Siloquay. Silica gel. I love theater. I love theater. Right? Oh. Um, but you yeah, know, like she, uh, she will introduce herself again, and she will like place a hand over her chest and give a small bow and say, "I am Siliquay Faldress. Uh, I suppose I was sent here to meet you." Apparently so. Why were you sent here to meet us? Oh, that's what I would like to know. Certainly wasn't Celestian who did it. Who? The Celestian's my god, by the way. Oh. I am his cleric. Oh, okay. Hmm. Hang on, hang on, ah, hang on. I understand. No. You will not get uh, my name from now. Raven, roll me a uh, religion check yeah. with, uh, with say, advantage. Oh, hang on a minute. Uh, I know I'm probably going to have to roll this. Uh, eh. Uh, 15. Explain your god! Uh, so, Celestian is also called the Far Wanderer. He is a god who travels planes, and the Outer Plains specifically. Um, he is neutral, good, I believe it was. Hang on, let me pull it up again. Um. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Yeah, he is he is a neutral deity. Uh charts the stars. Um he, he's pretty much he's a wanderer. Uh, okay. A lot of the people Um uh in fact our our belief is that we cannot stay in any one place for long. Okay. Well, that's going to work out uh, real well for this campaign. Right? Oh, yeah. We're gonna, never yeah. going to stay in the same place. Grok's going to step forward. Celestian, huh? Uh, my name is Grok. I'm a cleric of Nuwata. I thought you were made of stones. Hmm? I'm huh. thoroughly confused. So... <laughs> I'm Grok. I'm made of rocks, as you can see. Oh, I see. <laughs> Insert otter church Funny. here and there occasionally. <laughs> yes, this is our resident otter. Yeah. Yeah. He, uh... He's adorable. The otters chill until something isn't. Common. Although is I, although I, although I guess cleric of new. I guess that position of cleric of Nuwata is semi up in the air, considering events over the last little while but not quite 100 percent sure how that works at this moment yeah grok is a very great mother grok, you know. has, grok has failed she multiple religion best. checks at important moments and has very little clue where he's getting his powers from at this moment Yes, exactly. I was like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not giving you information You're that you don't deserve. Information. I failed those rules fair and square. I don't know shit. <laughs> I frankly, uh, frankly, I'm not. Brock isn't sure what the fuck the status of his god is at this moment. So it, your god is definitely alive. Yeah, that's all you know. That's a bit. There, there is a thing that I am worshiping that is giving me powers. Whether or not it is still Nuwata is a question. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay. Um. Friend, well, yes, as, Brock is still a great mother. <laughs> I assume so. Uh, as the 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 otter does the 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 pay attention to me dance. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Siliqua will kneel down before it and hold out her hand and say, "It is a pleasure to meet you, sir." I don't know if you had a name for him yet. Um, the, 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 as he extends his Gilbert. his little paw, he he says his name is Gil. Uh, most pleasure to meet you, sir, Sir Gil. Oh, you knighted him. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, okay. good night. <laughs> You've knighted him. This oh, okay. Is, this is where we end up with problems. Gilbert is a knight now. Sir Gilbert. She does Sir not Gilbert have the power the barbarian. to people. The barbarian funny, knight. What's funny is his name is a fucking joke. Sir Gilbert Einstein. Ah. <laughs> I love it. Uh, um. Well, I believe we should be able to, if it worked like it did before, we should be able to use a crystal to call our um ride, I guess you should say. Is that how it, we did it before? I don't I mean, remember. We've definitely done it like that at least once. The last yeah. couple times we've had to go back through the same gate we came out of. Before we go, I would like to just have a more... I would just like to tell my dad... Yes, go have a look <laughs> with your father. Well, I was going to say we should do a long rest and then you guys can have a, a full night to talk about things, and he can stay with his I dad. I agree with that. This is true, yes. Yes. Yeah, yes, yes. An idea, yeah. That way you guys can regenerate all your health and spell slots, considering you guys just had two big, massive fights. Yeah, yeah. I would deeply appreciate if we could do that. Okay, so... The rest it is. You guys <laughs> uh, start setting up to take a long rest. I am going to say that the squirrels move off of the platform here and allowing you guys to go to this platform to set up a tent. You guys set up a pretty, they set up a pretty large tent. It's a, and it has like four rooms in the tent itself as well. Like it's like, Ooh. It's a pretty large tent. It's about the size of the entire platform. Um, the uh, tent itself on the outer barrier of the tent, like down here on the beach, uh, they have set up a uh, roasting spit and multiple uh, roasted vegetables and different uh, foods. But there are, there's no meat, so it's yeah. just Oh it's damn a bunch it! Of forage. It's a bunch yeah. of foraged materials. Yes, I, I, I'm, um, sure and, that, uh, I'm sure that the half orc Grok is sitting there like, hmm, I don't know about this. <laughs> I mean, I don't care. I'm going crazy on the mix. Nuts. If you don't eat, He's I'm not, telling yeah. you right now. If you don't eat, you're taking a level of exhaustion. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um. Anybody... Uh, Brock, Brock is going to look over at Gilbert. Go fishing? Dinner? Well, fishing? Fishing. Yeah, <laughs> He'll I, reach, I... In, reach into his in, into his cheek, pull out a pouch, <laughs> and then from that pouch, pull out a fishing pole. And then shove the pouch back into his cheek. Wait, I got a better yeah, idea. Gilbert has a, a fucking idea. bag of holding in his mouth. Can I join you off with some fish? I I have an idea. Fish. I have talons and wings. I could literally just like fly overhead and try to grab some fish. Depends on how much you hey. care. I'm I'm just thinking like Gilbert's an otter and my character's a half orc. I think both of us would rather you know meet. <laughs> whoever whoever's going fishing, I mean... roll me roll me nature. Without advantage. Uh... Regular nature. Nature, uh, nature, nature. Boom. Will there be anything like specific added to that as well? Like, will I also need to roll a dex thing if I'm doing it by uh God damn like, it. you know, just grabbing them? No, because this is just grabbing. This is okay. just like a regular nature check. Yeah, nature roll. Okay. So uh Kale and Tempest do not find anything in the wild. Uh, as you let's say, as you go fishing, you Kale jump goes to dive down and grab a fish and misses completely and scares all the fish off. That <laughs> fuck, it fucks Tempest over as well. 
so Tempest can't get any fish either. Uh, Dragon, you managed to catch one fish, and Raven, you managed to catch three. Sweet. Yeah, fish. Well, I tried my best. Sorry, Tempest. <laughs> um, it's what? about, I would say right now, it's about sundown. So if you guys are going to do any RPing before bed, now would be the time to do it. Uh, whoever's going to RP first, whoever has the longest RP, let me know, because then we'll do that one last. Yes, I that, that would be me. Okay, so we'll do Matt's we'll do Matt's thing last. Um so yeah. What are you guys doing? And who's taking shifts? Oh, that's a good question. <laughs> I will always take a shift because it's a perception roll and I have been really good at that. I have the negative two and perception. And the last uh, time we let yeah. Tempest take a shift, we got screwed over. So, so with that being said, hey, I, I, <laughs> I wish to take a watch with whoever has the lowest perception. Not me. You guys Anyone? don't Anyone? need to do it in pairs because you guys are technically in town. You guys are just doing shifts because it is the routine. Also, aren't I sleeping with my dad? You? You? <laughs> Hey, yo. <laughs> what? Uh, also, no. Ray would not be sleeping in the same house as my dad. Yes, he would not be sleeping <laughs> there. Because they all have their own little homes. And you would not fit in their little home. You technically have a childhood place that you have slept in. But it is now a storage area. Last I checked, this place was in Alabama. It's definitely not Alabama. Wow. Look, I realized what I said. I was just gonna. I was just gonna. I was just gonna, was just gonna ignore it and move on. I'm not gonna say anything. Uh. All right. So, are you guys talking about anything? Other than the fact that I'm slowly contemplating uh, making fried bird, but uh... <laughs> oh yes, now you guys can see. Uh, I will now hit show to players on the character sheet. You guys should be able to see it now. Right. So I'm gonna say, uh... <clears throat> yeah, okay. what was what was your name again? Cece. Yes. I'm going to say, you know, essentially just, I don't, I don't know. I was going to say something about how it's weird to kind of just show up and I get it because I did that. I did kind of mm. just show up here. I don't even fully know what's going on here quite yet. I will make it be clear. I will let it be clearly know that I do not trust you, CC, at this time. Unless you have proven otherwise, because everything that sort of just pops in, as far as my experience goes, doesn't really turn out on all the free and clear. Thank you. Excuse me? Like everybody? Yeah. Well, actually, I, no, actually, I take that back. I was the last one to pop in. Never, I take yeah, that back. you were literally, well, I mean, technically, Ty was the last returned, one who just popped but in. The other two didn't know me. So. Yeah, that. Like we, we, the rest of us knew who Ty was already. Uh. <laughs> I have trust issues. There's a really funny thing. Trust me after I showed up in no odd situation. Hmm. Yeah, the uh. Yeah, I feel not like to, it, not to it, mention it the is, fact that the guy who got time. killed in front of you was more than likely the friend we mentioned missing. What did you say the person looked like? Did he perhaps uh, I will... look like stone? Yeah, big guy made of rocks. I'm assuming Kinda that's weird. him. Earth that would be that would be him. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, we didn't exactly speak, so I couldn't say much about the weird. But other than that, that sounds about right. An Earth Genasi. 
you know what that is? Do I know what that is? You would you would know what an Earth Grenasi is, yes. Okay, cool. Yes. I would say that he was one of those, yes. Yeah, that, that's that was almost certainly him. Then and I three seconds to mourn. Loss. All right, we're good. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Guzal's going to take a walk. Yeah. Brock is just kind of sitting there contemplating that one. I'm going to start meditating. Like, yeah. Right, right, right. Your first character. Unlike the others, like yeah. Dale kind of just went through the yeah. entire seven stages of grief in the span of six seconds. Y you all, uh, Kale yeah. also realistically hasn't known him quite as long as the as long as the others of us have. Yeah. yeah. Not like, only that, but I did kind of, of see first, like, like half a village get slaughtered <laughs> before I like. Like, yeah. as a little itty-bitty baby wizard, I watched, like, half my home village get slaughtered. Uh, so... Yeah, and Kale I, and I Tempest in general I have literally joined now. us at the beginning of the last chunk of this, so they've not known him terribly long, comparatively, but, uh... Brock, uh... Hmm. Yeah. Gil Gilbert Brock, has gone Brock down Gilbert. to the shore. I was gonna say, that's probably... <laughs> I was gonna say, Drizal's taking a, a, a walk along the beach. Yeah. Just... Grok can, yeah. Grok's not leaving the group, but he is con like silently contemplating that. Uh, roll for grief. Roll for grief. Roll for grief. <laughs> <laughs> roll, for grief. <laughs> Just, oh. <laughs> that be constitution? roll the one. <laughs> yeah. So you were overcome by depression. So yeah. what? What I wanted wanted to do at this present moment in time. Is I want Gil to kind of like start gathering up, you know, little bits of rocks that he finds on on the shorefront, <laughs> and just kind of uh, start start building building himself a, a little a little person that kind of resembled uh, Carrie. Roll me Ooh. investigation. No, not investigate. Roll me. God, Ooh. roll roll investigation. I'll look for rocks, and then roll me. I don't know. Intelligence. Roll an intelligence roll to, to see if you can <laughs> to see if you can make it. All right, you find uh, you find a little bit of rock. You find some rocks that kind of resemble kind of the figure of 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 him. <laughs> roll the seventeen, and you're able to make a perfect one to one creation of of uh... <laughs> <laughs> when it does. When it's not important, <laughs> but it's important enough. Uh, it's important for role play. It's important for role play, but it's not important for combat. You uh, make an entire one for one recreation of 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 Kale. Of uh, of uh, of of care. Yeah, I'm not dead. <laughs> Honestly, I I don't I don't think Gilbert's got that much of attachment to care. Not not care, but kale. Fuck. Yeah, Words. It confusing. Kale. Burb. <laughs> Burb. <So>. Bird. <clears throat> Bird. 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 Uh, Cece is just gonna give them all space. She did not know this guy. Yeah. He died in front of her. Emotions. What do they mean? Right, Ostenda? All right. And now for Matt and the Elder. Father. So I'm so I'm so relieved to have you. I am. I am glad to be back. I'm sorry. It's been so long. I, I should have treat I should have treated everyone with more respect. I understand I'm I'm different, but it doesn't make but it doesn't stop us from being a true family. I want to say, oh, I would be like, what is this hallmark level bullshit? Uh, <laughs> you want it on 
P, here you go. No, yeah, no, I, I mean, you're doing good. I'm just like, I'm just like, God damn, it. man. We, we love it, Matt. Keep it up. This is what we wanted. Father, you've no. grown silent. Is something the matter? I'm just... I'm just contemplating. <sighs> I was... I was gone there for a little bit. I saw the afterlife. I saw what was beyond. I... Through my friend's arcade magics, we have decided that it is not your time yet. Well, they, I, I didn't want you to leave. I, you, you didn't deserve all of this. This is just that thing, whatever it was, is of a higher, is of a higher, higher caliber. It's from a different world, I assume. As I've traveled multiple worlds, chasing whatever is sending these beasts, I didn't think, I didn't think for a second that they would actually come back to hurt you. And, and I, I'm glad I was able to destroy it in time, but I feel I, pr I, I fear I will have to continue on and chase it to the ends of the earth. Ah. Yes. Again, I thank you for for bringing me back. But now I must rest. It's been very stressful the last couple of hours, and I must think upon everything and rebuild our rebuild everything around us. Good plan. Uh, by tomorrow, we're probably gonna. We're pro I'm probably gonna get out of here with my group of friends and continue on our adventure. Yes, yes, of course, of course. You need to. You have a lot of work ahead of you. I saw great things in you, and now they are coming true. I'm very proud of you. I then, I then, I then say thank you in squirrel and farewell, and then just leave the and leave his home. He also says thank you in squirrel. Yeah, Ostenda, uh, I'm pretty sure uh, that's probably the case. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't, I don't have voice mod installed. We spent several uh, this is streams actually part of my mixer doing this, I to and do. we had a nice long month break. Yeah, it could have been a demon, but every time I press the button to become a demon, I keep accidentally pressing the button to become a squirrel. This is fucking hilarious. That's hilarious. <laughs> uh... great. It's great that all your demons sound like Alvin and the Chipmunks. Yes. Alright. Um, yeah, it is now, like, way past sundown. Uh, you guys start heading into into your respectful bedding areas for the night. First watch, roll me perception. Who wants first watch? I'll take it. Night goes by, you hear the sounds of rustling in the trees. You hear the sounds of wildlife hunting wildlife out in the wilds, but nothing happens to you directly. Second watch, wherever you are, roll perception. I'll take second. I'll go. Or not. All right. <laughs> Whatever. 17. 17, you hear the sounds of uh, more of uh, like more uh, nighttime creatures starting to wake up, rustle around, gather food and resources. Uh, there's a bunch of uh, things in the water that are splashing around relatively close by. Um, you can't really make it out. It's too dark out there. But uh, nothing that sounds dangerous. 
Nothing that sounds too dangerous. Okay. Not like an alligator or anything. And the night passes by relatively uneventful. Third watch. Last watch. I'll take it. My perception isn't I'm that so great. so glad that dragon rolled first. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Yeah, the two of you are awake. Uh and you uh Kale, you see nothing out there. Like you don't it's eerily quiet and you can't distinguish the sound of trees rustling from animals moving. On the other hand, Dragon, you could hear uh animals uh, morning animals starting to wake up. It is now dawn as animals are starting to wake up birds are chirping final day deer dawn of the final day yes <laughs> sorry I oh heard god that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the, moon, <laughs> the moon is right above your head it is looking straight <laughs> down at you it's just like what's up you want some of this huh you think you're piccolo you want some of this i'm sorry can you uh yeah, nothing really eventful happens the throughout the night. Me. Toss a sword at the moon and it shatters. Yeah. <laughs> the moon shatters. The fucking oceans swell. <laughs> well, it's a good thing we're not there anymore. You're literally on the edge of an ocean. Yeah. <laughs> but at least we're not at... What was it? Uh, Raven's Water home? World. Yeah. yeah. It'd be Gilbert's home. I oh, know it was Gil's home. It was Gil's home. That's what it was. It was Gilbert's home, yes. They All right. didn't even fucking know, notice. Hey, uh, you guys notice? Fucking... You guys notice your gems are flashing, and you hear the sounds of uh, return, return, as the a uh, bright pillar of light appears above where you originally came from. Well, looks like our ride's here. All right. Finally, I was tired of nuts. Rise and shine, everybody. There is a giant pillar of light in the sky. I think we gotta go there. Bye, Dad! I'm off to go save the multiverse! Bye, son! I'll miss you! Please see if you would like answers. I would suggest coming with us. That's where I will follow. It. I was gonna say it's where those gems originally come from. I almost said right. originally originated from. And <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna take to the cool. back and keep everybody in my sights. <laughs> Gil Gilbert's uh, still down by the shore. You guys... with, his, with his little figurine of uh, care that he made. Well, I need to bring everyone over here so I can copy and paste this. I'll go find little Otter Buddy. Gil, I think we're getting ready to leave. You, you'll see he also made himself a little campfire, too. Okay, so you guys travel for roughly about half a day. It takes you guys to get here. The, uh, oh, there's a second Gilbert here. Bye. No, oh, no, there's two of them. Double the otter. Double uh, the adorable. Yeah, so the portal has opened. There is a very large, ornate gate that has opened. Uh, and uh, yeah, there's the there's just like a bunch of little woodland creatures that have come out of the woods and are like, oh, ooh, ah! um, out with a quick examination of said gate, are there any runes or symbols that I might notice or recognize? 
There are ruins on the ground where the gate is coming out of. Uh, you can recognize them as uh, you recognize them as uh, symbols of the of the of of uh, of the king in the Forbidden One. The Forbidden One. Yes. Exulu. No one's no one's ever tried to examine the symbols before. I mean, that's fair, honestly. Yeah. Uh... What do you think we are? Smart? You're you guys you you're the intelligent one. You're the one with the intelligent score. Yeah, man. Yeah, literally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You can't, I'm the you can't only say one with the intelligent score. I mean Not to be anymore. fair, my to be fair, uh, my intelligence is ten now. So what do I know about the Forbidden One? Uh what you know of the Forbidden One is that he is a old god from another from another plane he's the one that creates he creates life and takes life okay so it's a it's a cycle of life balance thing yeah and moves us all <laughs> okay just gonna bring so out not Lion necessarily King. an evil god just more of a neutral one yeah he's 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 a god that People don't necessarily pray to. He's just one uh -huh. that's just he's there to do his job, and that's it. Okay. Dragon, can you do me a favor? Your microphone is picking up your TV a little bit more than usual. Can you mute? Can you mute your mic? Um. And final question: You said that I recognize the symbol of the king. What king? The king. The king of all realms. Oh, and what do I know of him? He, well, you're about to meet him. Uh, but he is the the king and almighty. He literally is the one that created the realms that of which you guys are all from. Okay. He killed my bird. He did kill your bird. Mm hmm. So yeah, did you challenge him? him? He did I challenge him. <laughs> So Cece spends some time observing the, the runes on the ground, and all she says is, oh, that's interesting. And she seems a lot more eager to see where this is going now. And Rest in peace, Cluck Norris. Oh, um, and then she'll, she'll point out the symbols for the Forgotten One and say what they're for, and then she'll remind you who he is. And then she'll point at the symbols for the king and remind you who he is. Oh, I know who the king and is. She seems... I've met him in person. You have met this man in person? We and all have. He killed my bird. He killed she, Cluck her, Norris. Her hands are doing a thing and she, she seems like she's attempting to speak but no words are coming out but she is visibly <laughs> excited right now. Mind I, blown. I, my god they might be more of a nerd than I am <laughs> skill I mean, issue the difference is, is that is is that she's she's like street nerd and your book nerd there's different nerds <laughs> fair <laughs> alright so uh yeah you guys are entering into the portal? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I will bring you guys to the Windows security update that just happened on my computer. Yeah. I, I needed that. Thank of course you. you did. You needed the security update. No, well, there's now there's now four Gilberts on this screen. That's cool. I mean, perfect. I can only carry one gill at a time. <laughs> All right. So I'm as multiplying. You, as you guys. Why is the squirrel the four brain cells? Sorry. <laughs> oh shit! The squirrel's here. <laughs> <laughs> new new NPC character coming with us. Mellow's dad. And then, uh, the, squirrel, the squirrel. The squirrel enters into the portal. 
And then the, the, guy, the guy in the portal room goes, Power word kill! And kills the squirrel. I cast counter spell. Oh, no. <laughs> you can't counter spell a ninth level spell. I'm just going to put that out there. Yeah, you can with a ninth yes, level you can. spell. Yeah, with that, yeah, you don't have ninth level spell slots. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so in other words, you can counterspell a ninth level spell, but you can't counterspell yeah, it. Yeah, that one. You, you can't just do jump it. in front of the power word kill. It's not a beam, it's literally just a. Yeah. You are if there. I see it's it, it dies. It's just saying, it's literally okay, so... just saying a word so powerful that your target dies. So... Yes, yeah, that okay, one. So if they don't you see it, it, so if they don't see it, it doesn't die. But they end up seeing me instead. That's not how that spell works. <laughs> and it's a... you're <laughs> I know you're trying. What you're trying to do, but I'm just saying that's not how that spell works at all. You can't peasant rail cannon power word kill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh. Okay. So you uh, guys you have now finished are in that place. Right. We are now bleep. Hooray! Four mm -hmm. realms four realms completed. And then also this oh. realm well, this realm and this realm don't exist. Oh, that's right. Eh. Wait, what? You're not, you're, not, you're not allowed to look at those realms. One of which they is don't home. exist. Oh, okay. so I guess the immediate thing we should probably go see the king. Uh, yes. So you yeah. guys enter into the portal room. A for uh, I keep forgetting your character name. Uh, CC. CC. I'm gonna say CC. CC. The squiggles easy. of no. So CC. Uh, you enter into this portal room and you see, uh, this large, magnificent. A uh, huge like structure that's here, and it's all marble. It's marble laden with gold tile and gold emblems everywhere, with red and blue drapery across the sides. Each of the portals that you see that have don't have check marks on them are open and are ready to be walked through. The other ones are they're not closed, but they are like smaller they shrunken in size so they are essentially you can't you can't fit through them like they're small enough that they're there but you can see through them but you can't fit through them um uh there is two people in this room uh they're fairly large even for your standard they're about 10 feet tall oh, wow. and they are standing there with uh halberds and they are pointing towards a hallway that isn't on the screen because the screen is a map I found on Google Ma Images and it doesn't have... I, ju I just figured the hallway was that little thing in the middle that looks like a staircase going down. Yeah, I I, I, I was using that as a pillar, like, with oh. that, like a, a... But sure, we can do that too. Um, it's They're pointing towards, like, the exit for you to leave to get out of this room. Bob, Joe, uh, I we get it. Uh. Oh. Hey, look, it's your dead bird. CC will just follow people. She wants to exp she wants to look at the portals more, but that's not what's important right now. Yeah, it's we're we're gonna be coming back here. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you guys enter into the throne room, and it is a lot more uh clean than it was the last time that you guys were here. There is they've cleaned up the uh the 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 damage from before, but also you notice that the area is a lot older. And looking a lot more uh, damaged in the time that you have been here uh, since you've been here last. Uh, the king is 
uh, over here, and he is basically he's st he's sitting and he has his hands he has his head in his hands, and he is looking down onto the ground as you guys enter into the throne room, opening up the big doors at the far side. He looks up and he doesn't notice you right away. He just like kind of like shoes you away. He's like, not now, not now. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, oh, it's you guys. What's up, your highness? You tell us where to go. What's the word? What's the deal? No, okay, no, okay. Uh, he casts lightning bolt on you now. <laughs> uh, he were bad. He he's like it took you guys so much longer than usual to get here. How many years this time, bud? Thousands. Damn. A a and you lived through all of that. I am technically an immortal. Ah, that explains it. <laughs> Everyone gets power world kill. I see you've made a new friend. Who is this? Wait, you're still here? I'm going to, uh... Oh, fuck off. God I'm damn it. to move the power my world kill. character out of the way. <laughs> no, no, no! Kill my dad after what we've been through. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we were Moving actually hoping we were actually hoping you could shed some light on that one. Wait. We'll, what? We'll so bow. you mean for thousands? Of, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to interrupt. Wait, it just came popped in my head. You mean for thousands of years? This this dead bird has just been. <laughs> oh no! It's 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 it's, it's their bones. It is now just a they're skeleton just of a they're bird. There's just skeletons in the. There's just a skeleton yeah. in the fountain. Hey, actually, you know what? Then I'm taking the skeleton. Cluck Norris. <laughs> Cluck Norris <laughs> lives on. Sure, you can have your ske bird skeleton. Guys, that's dumb. Cluck Norris. Also, also, I don't, I don't like Chuck Norris because political reasons. Anyway, yeah. moving on. Yeah, I don't, I don't agree with it, but it's funny. So that, that's the main thing. Yeah, moving, moving on. on. I, I finished. I finished. Like, he asked about uh, CC, and I'm just like, we're hoping you could shed some light on that one. Uh, CC will bow and introduce herself as Siloque Faldras, uh, a cleric of Celestian, and I am rather confused. Show him your hand, CC. Yeah, show him, show him the hand. She's going to assume you mean the hand with the gem, so she will mm -hmm. lift it. Uh, he, like, opens, dim he casts dimensional door and teleports all the way over here and looks at your hand. And he's just like... Hera disappeared and she showed up with him. Hera Copra monk named, like, named Gluck Norris. Damn. Did, did we, the other, it, like, did we like, get a replacement? Like the bird. Yes. <sighs> this complicates things. These yeah, are so not supposed to be this is not, these are not supposed to be transferable like this. And you, why is yours destroyed? Oh, no. Yeah. Looking at me, looking, at me, looking yes. at me this time with the gaping hole yeah. in my hand. Um, remember when I, when we were here last and the little egg was in there? Uh, it had. <sighs> Lovely. Uh, I need you to come with me. Point of that, but okay. I need you to come with me. Yep. And he takes takes your hand and casts Dimension Door, oh, okay. bringing you. Blah. Blah, brings you up here. Blah. Uh, he like 
goes into his it, it, into like a bag that's like hanging off the side of the off the side of the uh the throne and opens it up and it you as soon as he opens it up uh raven this huge amount of arcana energy starts to pour out in fact that even the people who are all the way at the end can kind of feel it even the people who are not arcana oh. uh sensed he reaches into it and his hand disappears into this bag and out oh. pops out uh, the crystal that was in your hand okay I knew he was getting them from somewhere, but. I got this from you. He then Brock grafts was it. Thoroughly confused about that statement, but okay. He grafts it back to your hand, and as soon as he grafts it to your hand, you feel like. Five million years worth of time gets put into your body. It is a lich. Yeah, that sounded pretty lich. Uh, I need you to roll me. I need you to roll me constitution. Of course. Save. Gross. Yay. Roll to not throw up. Uh, no, this wasn't roll to throw up. This is the roll to stay conscious. Oh. Um, you remain conscious during this entire ordeal as you oh, see, boy. as you see within ten seconds. For ten seconds, you see your entire life flash before your eyes. You just got hit your the death note when Kira touched the book. Ink, ink, shut up! I am role playing. Thank you. Including your, uh, including your death, you and where they've buried you, oh. and then a hand reaching and grabbing your skeletal remains and grabbing a gem out of your skeletal remains and grafting it to your hand. Everybody watches Grok just kind of stand there. His eyes glaze over, and he almost looks like he's having a seizure, standing up for a few minutes. Before, well, it's like 10 seconds. Yeah, for yeah. a couple for like 10 seconds before his eyes like before he just his eyes like refocus and he blinks and just kind of like eyes wide like contemplating what the fuck. Uh he then instructs you that you can leave whenever you are oh. able to. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just kind of stumbles down the stairs a little bit and just kind of walks back over to everybody else. Yeah. I have so many questions. <laughs> <laughs> not not the least of which being how the fuck you reached forward in time and pulled the gem off me in the future when I didn't have it anymore. But alternate future. I guess I was gonna say, who says it was this future? Ah, okay. Like Rock has many a question. That that's definitely up there. Uh, yeah. So you, uh, he is like, well, there's only two places left for you two to go to. Mm -hmm. uh, you can either A, go to Drizal's home dimension or Grok's. Not Grok, I mean... Um, I've already been to mine, yeah. <laughs> no. The, uh, the, the, what was the Boo Boo's character Care. called again? Care. Care. Um, Here's home dimension. You have to make this choice. This will be. I know that that you have lost a friend and you wish to grieve. 
for your loss, but we are on the home stretch. There's not much time left. I vote for the second one. Do so I say we leave it up to Drizelle. I mean, if we go to Cares, we have the potential to be able to inform his next of kin. Do you even know any of them? I said there's the potential. Do have any? Talk to each about each other. I said the potential. I didn't say we'd be able to find anybody, but. Fair enough. Yep. The possibility is there. I feel we should go there. I don't feel up to seeing my home in ruins at the moment. We all know how well okay. it went when we went to go see mine. Brock just starts walking towards the portals. Also, in character reason, I need to actually figure out my fucking backstory better. So oh, yeah, I, yeah, I was yeah, gonna fair. say, like, if we're if we're going to Drizelle's place, I'm just gonna have to make up some bullshit along the way because yeah. the. <laughs> You haven't made anything about your character at all. I haven't. I mean, I made more about my character. We were just like, fuck it, you're Squirrel Tarzan. <laughs> okay, but like, That's because Tarzan your character I design was weird. Not that I'm complaining. Not that I'm complaining. You're also a slime! I what I... Overkill. I'm I specifically speaking. remember... Overkill, I specifically remember that uh, when I told you about my character concept that he started learning magic because the very little bit of magic that he knew as a hobby is the only thing that kind of saved his village from a great evil that is technically dead. You said that you had a way to work with that, so I'm still wondering what direction you're going there. Well, the answer oh, to that question even, is, I... as an Aarakocra, you're probably from the same world as uh, Drizal, the Air Genasi. I'm... I yeah. I have I already have a entire section set up for your area for your for your thing. We're not going there because we're not going to we're not going to the the, the area. So Raven kind of nailed it on the head. Yeah, I was just, it's just kind of my assumption is that the Birdman is probably from the same place as the Air Person. All right, you guys enter into the portal room. You guys will be going into this portal here, up here, in the upper section. As we're walking section. back to this area, I don't know who, but she gets close to someone and she's like, so wait, all of those portals are to different dimensions. Yes. I think the appropriate term is question, realm. Question. That's, that, that part's just sort of general knowledge of, of this world for people living in those realms, right? Yes, this is this yeah. is general knowledge, right? That, yeah, that's that's general world knowledge for living in this world. Is that there? Are Sorry, I, I, yeah. there forgot are, to mention that that yeah, there are multiple realms, uh, kind of separated from each other via these sorts of portals. Every realm has its own like portal, like main like gate thing for people to be able to go between them. Though yep. travel is so, restricted, semi. Yep. So. Once someone says yes, her immediate response is, I've always wanted to travel to another realm. There you go. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, because well, each of the realms come. is, uh, each of the realms has their own um, resource that is farmed and is brought to each other's realms. So um, I could show you the bigger map. So this is what the realms look like. Uh, sorry, I drew this at MS Paint in like 10 minutes. So. It's not great, but um, each of hey, the I, realms. I need, I need to take five. I gotta take out the dogs. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I have to go. I have to go get the map anyway. So the 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 the. But we're going to this brown one. That's what we're going to now. Is that the otter again? This is the otter. Yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. Yeah, we we have so All far. Say... We have so far, we started in yellow, then we went to blue, then we went to red, and we just finished green. Yes. So now we're going to brown. I will say. Yep. You will say? You will say? 
I will say about having always wanted to visit other realms. First time I ever left my home realm, I encountered a group of morons that forgot to kill a lich. So, be careful what you, what you wish to kill for. A lich? Brock, Brock is just going to look. I'm wondering this. Brock is just going to look over his shoulder back at back at him, like, "Look, we killed it once, and <laughs> then we were fall. Next thing we knew, we were falling from the fucking sky." We didn't really have much and chance to look for a phylactery. Did you notice like that Raven self-enters himself? Right, right. Remind me who's cat. Remind me who had to catch you from the sky again. Yes, because you just happened to be there. Thankfully, not like we, you're welcome. Like, look, look. You've been with us long enough at this point to appreciate how weird shit gets sometimes. Sometimes. You're fighting a demon, and then and the minute you kill it, suddenly you're plummeting from the sky fifty feet up. <laughs> it ju it's just kind of how things go around here. All right. All right. So, uh, yeah. So each of the realms farms their own materials. Uh, as you can see, the blue uh, has like natural water and like fish and resources involving water. Uh, red is where ore is mined and processed. Uh, uh, precious gems are in the yellow. Uh, green is where all forestry happens and farming and stuff like that. Uh, brown is where you get uh, soil and rock and other materials that involve the ground. And then uh purple is where uh there are flying sky mountains that are that have a bunch of resources in them and then we've got gilbert to tie it all together and you could choose a color however whatever world that you want to be in you could say so right now and that's where you're from Green. i need to think about that okay i will say brown <laughs> yeah wasn't it green uh, world you're in the green realm. Yeah, green realm was you, red realm was me, blue was Gilbert, and uh were any I drew this after one? everyone picked their colors. Yeah, I was sitting here like did yeah. was anyone actually from the yellow one? I don't think we ever acknowledged No, that. yellow was yellow. yellow was an open realm. Okay. Yeah, uh the prince had the gem for the yellow. Yeah. Okay. We are going to take a very quick little break while I get a Bye, map. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. In that case, I'm going to go grab more ice and a drink. Yes. Yep. <clears throat> Pardon me. Oh yes. You need to get those. I like that I typed in farmland map into Google Images. And the first map is a map of a chess field, of a chessboard. Ooh, chess. That's definitely farmland. Yep. AI is great, you guys. Mm-hmm. I I still I'm still on the on one thing when it comes to AI that will make life a lot easier, and that is making instruction manuals, making tour guides, and making um any like monotonous task that you need to hire like a typist to make so that's actually been worked on actually uh, nobel, cool. nobel prize for chemistry this year went to a pair of guys one from the university of toronto where they managed to to build an ai algorithm 
to to create proteins from just building blocks. Like they gave the they they fed the the algorithm all the building blocks for proteins, and now it is creating almost like sixty years of scientific research in like a month. That's, That's pretty scary. Yeah. Like they're literally using the knowledge that they're getting from having these protein structures be like created into figuring out if we can actually use them. Yeah. Like it's fascinating. It's also terrifying. It's very terrifying. Oh yeah. Moving too quickly is why I don't like. Yeah. Yeah, that's because we already know stuff that goes too quickly is not always the best. The feeling when the robot might actually figure out how to master humans. That's fascinating. Yeah, that that is kind of a thing about technology. That is kind of a thing about technology. The more it advances, the more it can advance. Uh, Ty, did you ever renew that incarnate? Uh, subscription? I did. I might need to again. Let me look and make sure. I'm just, while we're on break, kind of just eyeballing over details of the uh, VGC tournament that group I'm help, a group I'm part of is hosting. And I'm just sitting here staring at the, uh, at the standings and the teams being used, and I'm just like, what the fuck is even happening over here? Okay, no, I do not have the $5 right now to re-up Carnet. Okay, no problem. I'll probably just, I'll just, I'll just do it, and then you can share, I'll share the account with you. This guy's running, Next. this guy's running a Skarmory, Scizor, and a Vaporeon. <sighs> Like, yeah, we can use I'll this. Be, I'll, can... I'll be uh, I'll be re-upping my thing as soon as I have the five dollars. So, uh, we should have the five dollars by Wednesday. Yeah, that's when I get paid. Are you getting paid this? Yes, it was last week that you didn't get. Paid. Yep, because I worked Thursday and I worked yesterday, so I will be paid Wednesday, some point yeah. Wednesday. Apologies. That's okay. No you gotta we're walk not the even, dogs. That's important. We're not even ready yet. I'm still yeah. putting the map down. Yeah. Okay. He's prepping a map. I'm going over tournament, Pokemon tournament stuff. Just I am what... finishing last of a picture that I started a while back. That I never continued. Squirtle, get out of here! Power work kill. Yep. There goes Mello's dad again. It's gonna be the running gag from now on. Just squir- <laughs> squirrel, squirrel mayor. Just power pop- forward kill yeah, squirrel. Squirrel mayor just pops up on every map when we pop through a portal and just immediately gets power word killed by the gods. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's almost as classic as Grok being a mother. Yeah, these two maps are good enough. We're not yeah. going to be doing too much tonight. Too much more tonight, anyway. Yeah. I'm just looking at the teams being used in this tournament, and this one guy with the really offbeat team. I'm just like. Oh god, there's no way this guy's doing well with this. And zero, yep, he's got zero wins, two losses right now. Okay, yep, that that makes sense to me. What do you mean he's not last place? Look down. I mean, one a guy, the guy who has you know pretty regularly either been in finals or won the tournament is currently in last place. And I'm like. Fuck, what random offbeat team did he decide to use today? And that is a regular, really good, well-performing team. 
you have a snake uh, the, right now or <laughs> the 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 luck the luck meter is uh, run out yeah the luck meter is not there today although quite frankly if this is anything like the last couple times he's simultaneously playing a tcg tournament That sounds like so, the thing I would do. So I don't, I don't know if we have all of his focus today. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Done? That's good enough. That's we're we're good now. I like this. Still cannot show up to his match. Oh, he did. Power work kill. Oh. Soil Kenny's oh okay he had to drop <laughs> because of a work thing okay <laughs> the running joke of What's oh up? we run into a squirrel yeah and powered kill we've run we have run over the squirrel <laughs> well I guess that was the power word kill in action I guess power word kill run him over with our car. We don't even have a car. Yeah, our fantasy car. Right? Our world run him over. Get him. <laughs> Get him. I like I like I love I like the phrase I like the phrasing in this message. A sudden emergency has taken place, IRL. I must go. That's <laughs> 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 Wondering why this match suddenly went 2-0 for one guy real fast. Oh. I have to leave. Goodbye. I must leave. My planet needs me. Oh, Is everybody God. ready to restart? I am. Yeah. You. Yeah? I mean, yeah. All right. I'm looking for something to snack on. Yeah. Boop. This is I'm just kidding. Okay. We're back. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hey. Hello. So, we now return to Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, uh, this is not technically where you are. I just couldn't find a map that looked good enough to be a portal room. So we're just going to use our brains. There. Uh, theater of the Those mind. Those are imagination. Yeah. All right, I am now. I uh, the roll a roll a d one hundred. Uh, that is how much damage you take. Oof. <laughs> you, Jeez, uh, you're dead. Fucking die. Uh, how power word times, kill. <laughs> how many times <laughs> is he going to resist the fucking power word kill? <laughs> Uh, are you sure he's a squirrel? squirrel. We don't sure quote he's just train. We don't. We don't quote train Sentai in this place. <laughs> in these dang old parts, it's absolutely appropriate. Sometimes that's all. <laughs> the best thing about that, about that, about that was episode three. <laughs> no, that was the moment. <laughs> You knew that show wasn't going to be serious in any way, shape, or form. In any way! <laughs> Look, man, if ever you need a giant robot made out of trains breaking out of a coffin with its train penis and blowing steam out of the tip, that, that, that wasn't even the, the part I was talking about. That was the bot, the fucking main boss standing on top of the train going, I'll defeat you, and goes under a bridge and breaks both his swords. Yeah, <laughs> I think that was episode two. <laughs> fucking goddamn, dude. And I was like, as soon as I saw that, I went, all right, this is definitely not a Sentai I'm going to like. This is, yep. Yeah, this is, there's no level of seriousness here at all. Okay. This is where we're where we are, and I'm just sitting there like, man, this is the first Super Sentai I've watched since Go Kaiser. And I will say, I will say, you know what? Fuck it, I'll say it. The third best auxiliary ranger in the entirety of Sentai. 
I'll give him that. Was in. I loved. I loved preacher. him. Fucking. I loved he, him. He was awesome. He made that I show loved semi him. worth it. All right. Anyway, let's start. Okay. Yeah. So you guys are transported into a. Uh, it, it 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 transported into a field. This field is, is has a large pedestal about I would say about two hundred feet wide, and uh, has pillars coming up the side of it made out of uh, ivory and marble. Uh, as you guys exit out of the portal, the portal immediately shuts behind you, and you guys are ushered in by the locals a bunch of earth drana uh, earth dranasi are here uh to bring you toward to your destination they uh ask you uh well first they ask you uh why you're here why you guys have been sent Why, I, why, why are we coming in business to the king? To slay uh, whatever darkness you'll be dealing with, I guess. Darkness. I don't... You know? I mean, you're here for a reason, so I yeah. guess... I guess we'll figure it out. Uh, I, that, we haven't... I haven't seen anything out of the ordinary, but... yeah. Hey, any you never like, know. No, any, nothing. Chat. Yeah, nothing weird at all. No missing persons. No. Uh, unexplainable phenomenon. No poison miasma. No, that was a different world. No random um, woodland creatures fusing together into monstrosities. No, we speak from experience. That's why we're yeah, being. That's so the specific. thing that happened. Like, why are you being so specific? <laughs> that, that's, a, that's a very, that's a very Just specific figure, thing. Clear that up. Hi, my name's my name's Ranok, and how how are you? That's normally how you start a conversation. <laughs> not have you guys seen any woodland creatures turn into abominations? <laughs> <laughs> have you or a loved one like been exposed man. to poison my asthma? Look, man, we've been you through may be some entitled shit. to compensation. Look, man, we've been through some shit. <laughs> Call one eight eight one eight hundred in like the past three days. I've seen some things, man. It's some stuff. Oh, I, this. I apologize for my companions. We've been through quite a time recently. Um, it's been a rough couple of days. We're just a sleepy on... otter in in the antlers. Oh, shut up and let him cook. On uh, or we are here by orders of the king, uh, just to see if there is any anything amiss in the realm. Okay. All right. Uh, well, if we, would you like to come to, to our, our town or, or would you like to come to our little, sure. our little area, good place, our city? Good place to start. We'd be honored. Yes, please. Thank you. Lead the way. All right. They start leading you down this, uh, really like kind of walking path essentially there's like this path that leads uh uh that's paved not really paved but it's kind of like just compacted uh rock and stuff like that that they have laid out normally we don't use our well we don't usually walk anywhere uh but when we saw that the portal opened, we knew that there was going to be less of us. So, you know, 
us coming out of the, you know, popping out of the ground might seem a bit weird. Uh, we actually used to have an Earth Genasi like yourself in our number. We're so oh? used to it. Speaking of, you guys wouldn't happen to uh, know of an Earth Genasi by the name of, I guess, Care for us. Care for us. I don't know what his last name was offhand. He didn't have one as far as I know. Uh, I I certainly do not know. But that's understandable. Have there, there been there... any uh, mentions of people, of somebody going missing? Has anybody noticed a family member or friend hasn't been around lately? I mean, we come and go so often that we don't really report that kind of stuff unless we, like, actually know that they've gone missing. Like, we're we're all kind of adventurers and travelers and workers where we just go wherever the work is needed. The only right. reason why we have, like, a city in general is for commerce, essentially, where we can sell our wares and get extras because we don't normally stay in one place you're more of nomadic people yes mm -hmm. yes exactly of so people in town might know your questions more than i would because i am new to this area i am i only came here for work rather recently okay well. um at least I need you. Your beginning days are interesting. As you guys are walking, I need uh, everyone to roll me perception. Uh, what's the light level as we're walking through? It's about midday. It's about just before noon. So bright. It's pretty bright. Yeah. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, you're trying you... to persuade. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! Oh, I thought, oh, I didn't Reveal see that. Your I thought it was the to me. <laughs> I was about to say uh, like, the tin is not the end of the world, but that's not his persuasion. Yeah, yeah. Marshall trying to uh, persuade the cosmos to let him see things. Okay, but Cece's persuasion actually makes sense because she is looking everywhere with the widest eyes. Mm. Yes. Uh, the old childlike wonder. Huh? The old childlike wonder. Yes. One second, this, I look, lost the map. I'm in a different realm. Roll 20 like deleted my map. Oh, no. Me meanwhile, poor Gil. He's just, he, he's too tired and kind of espresso depresso. Oh. His Fuck. buddy is gone. All right, which one of you son of bitches made the made the the the, the otter cry? <laughs> this motherfucker is like, all right, who who made the otter cry? Because now now we we have to go on a hunt. <laughs> okay, so because you guys rolled pretty good, you guys do notice something. You guys notice that they are very obviously leading you around in circles. Oh. Oh, no. I'm gonna just flick out the dagger claw, the dagger claws. Uh. uh just gonna stretch not like trying to a little draw, bit. Not trying to, not trying to draw attention to it. Just getting them ready. Rock. Oh. It's murder time. Rock looks over at one of the, uh, okay. the one of the guys guiding them. It's like, so, where precisely is this town? Oh, it, it just up ahead, just up ahead. Mm -hmm. You've been leading us in circles. Um. Uh, well, somebody's not certain. Somebody's not here for subtlety. <laughs> Sir, do you know what a yeah, fair? Where are you taking us? 
I'm assuming that it's just because you're not used to walking on the surface and you're used to moving among the rock. Please tell me I'm correct. I hope whoever you're leading us to is ready to get fireballed. The time to roll for completely quiet. I feel like he's rolling for initiative. I feel like he's pulling up a good (laughs) Mm -hmm. (laughs) I feel like this long silence is pulling up fucking enemies. He's just taking the time to get icons ready. Yeah, like we're we're about to get jumped. Who among you guys looks like the sturdiest fighter type? I mean, (laughs) I'm a monk. Raven. I mean. You're, you're, you've uh, got two, que- well, two questions. The heavily armored one or the otter barbarian? Uh, the otter that's holding a sword that's like twice his size. Look, okay, I'm, I'm with the, the armored, armored barbarian one. all the way. I don't, I'm sorry, y'all. Probably the armored one. Yeah, that you guys correctly yeah. roll initiative. Oh. All right, so as. The water rat with as, my life. Guys, as you guys are talking, God uh, damn it. Reach, reach over and touch Raven. Um, and do Vigilant Blessing, which gives you advantage on your next initiative roll. Oh, all right. Oh, you... you can do that? It's something I get as a Twilight uh, Cleric. Okay, I said You're it. a cleric? Yeah. Oh my god, yeah. you yeah. were not paying attention. I set, I set it to advantage, but apparently initiative only rolls once. Yeah, just roll it again. Oh. Okay, yeah. 20 it is. It automatically changed it. God damn it. Oh no! I apparently did not select my token when I rolled my initiative. I didn't either. Good job. Good job. God, you guys suck. I'm sorry. Okay. How long? I got, hey, I got a nat 20 initiative. Not that it worked. That's such a waste of a nat 20, though. Oh. <laughs> right. Uh, I think it's great, I know, but also. But at the same time. That's the first time I've rolled good for. What was your I initiative? I think anything. 12? Yeah, 14. I had a 12. Oh, and yeah. Gilbert. And 14. And, yeah, CC's was 14. Yeah, CC had a 14. Okay, there we go. Now I gotta add Hey, at least we're all in double digits. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good one. I mean, Like, with our lowest being a 12, that's not bad. Oh, wait, never mind. I just saw Marshall's. Oh, no, Marshall says it's a 14. Look, I don't know why my initiative is always like dog shit, but here we are. Why did you roll your initiative twice? I think it bugged. Oh. Yeah, my bad. Whatever. I'll just keep the, the 14. I don't give a fuck. I'm too... I am... I am not dealing with that. Cool. <laughs> Honestly. Oh, wow. Makes sense. These guys are really big. Okay, exactly the same initiative. Cool. <laughs> well, talk about a waste of a waste of waste of good roll. Seven. Descending. Starting with Raven. Uh, Raven, these, uh, these, uh, I'm gonna say Draenei because I'm playing World of Warcraft. Uh, what are they called again? Draenasi. Draenasi. There's no R. Draenasi. Uh, the yeah these ja. these the ja. G-E. oh ja, G-E. Janasi. like a genie. Uh, they the 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 four that were carrying you, that were what that were taking you yeah. away. 
uh, they transform. They 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 shed off of their skins and become hags directly in front of you. Oh. Uh, when they do, they also screech out loud, and these very large eyeball creatures come out oh, and lovely. they come out of the trees and meet you there as well as these earthen metallic creatures come out of the ground oh what do you do sir okay i don't suppose we could talk about this No. Okay. Well, glad we asked. Yeah, certainly nice to know. Mm -hmm. Your bones will make good soup. We've defeated how many? De uh, how many demons now, everyone? Yeah, this is just kind of Tuesday. You can make soup out of these nuts. Also, I would like to make a intimidation check because I am trying to intimidate this bitch. You gotta actively do that on your turn. Intimidation versus their insight, I'm guessing. I mean, it's just an intimidation. I don't know. Uh, uh what it would be sure. You can roll intimidation. I'll I'll see if that. Uh, I'll be the judge if it uh, if it scares them or not. CC just holding up a hand with a zero on it. That is an 18. They are weary, I'll say. They're not scared. Mm, but they aren't going to take this lightly. No, now they're, now, now they're pulling up the big guns. Now they've leveled up. Now they're level 12. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> now they're 12th level monsters. Don't punish me for trying to be good in roleplay! All of a sudden, you see that their hair starts to glow a bright yellow. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no! Thanks, <laughs> Wolfen. I didn't do it. it, it it's time for me to oh, make like, you a blame Raven. Like a it dip. was me who did it! <laughs> <laughs> you go, you go to leave? One. It's Raven's yeah. fault. It's you go, you go. Raven's fault. Dragon, Anyways. Dragon goes to leave, and he does an mm -hmm. instant, like, an instant transmission Kamehameha and disintegrates the order. Right. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pull up a sword and swing at the uh, one immediately in front. Wow, you're not gonna summon your dude? No. It Honestly, oh. I got multiple ways of doing this, and there's not a good thing for him just yet. Also, you don't have him on the board, so I'll oh, save shit. you that just yet. I'll save you that for now. Uh, <laughs> fuck! I put him in the archive. God damn it! <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna take a swing at the one immediately in front of me. Uh, that's a hit. Thirteen oh, wait, damage. Wait, he'd be in the wait. He'd be in the battle arena. He'd be in the battle arena. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, pop, I'm gonna pop thirteen. Work. Yeah, 13 damage. I'm going to pop a War Priest to make a second attack. Okay. Probably not. <laughs> no, that Roll is a... Two. Okay. That is a miss, and he is going to... They are going... He's going to... Uh, Wait. Raven, do me a... Didn't hit. My second what? attack didn't hit. The second attack, the 10. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. No, the 21 right. hit. The tw the 10. Yeah, the 21 landed, the, the 10 okay. didn't. Yep. And apparently okay. they have uh, some reaction sorry. to missing. Ra uh, Raven, roll me a wisdom save. Ooh, all right. This is Raven mode, aka Dark oh, Souls no. mode. <laughs> oh, no. All right, you saved. All right, cool. Uh, I guess I don't have to find out what that was about. Uh... No, no, you do not. Yeah. Anyways, uh, yeah, that'll be my turn for now. Bored. Bored. This is like one of the first times that Kale ever goes up in a 
close to the yeah. top of the turn order. Oh, you're uh, you're here. here. Wait, um, one second. I need to fix you guys. Can I put you guys in your right squares? That'd be great. Thanks. There we go. Yeah. Cool. All right. Awesome. Okay. If I were to fly like. If you were to fly right now, you would take an attack of opportunity. There's a guy My immediately AC in front is of 10. You, and you would probably so get So let's in. not do that. Uh, hmm. I'm just, I'm just helping you because you probably didn't see this guy because he's kind of merging into I the freaking background. Guy. I yeah, no, I did see that guy. I was I was wondering if moving up triggers an attack. Can I get away from does. him in time? Any movement uh... outside of his threat square counts as a movement. If you you can technically, if you have um not blink, that's a different spell. Um misty step, you can leave. You can also just disengage but that will take your action you, you can also disengage but you can only disengage left or right because you can't disengage backwards and you can't disengage up I completely forgot to I forgot to fix my spell slots from last long rest uh, what I think I'm gonna do is once I get this right what I'm gonna do let me scroll down Should I make a roll to uh, try to touch him? Uh, not a seduction roll. No. no like a melee. Creature or object you see within range to grow larger or smaller, choose either. So it's oh, no, it's ranged object you can see. It's a ranged. Yeah. yeah, no, it's oh, a ranged. I thought, oh, I always remembered it being It can a make a constitution saving spell. throw, but you're doing a, you're doing a spell with someone within melee, so you'd still the, he would have advantage? Yes? Well, I don't know, because it's not a ranged spell attack. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's just a uh, it's a save, I believe, if, you, if you're if you doing it to an, uh, to an unwilling yeah. target. Yeah, if the target is unwilling, it can make a constitution saving throw. I want to make the uh, metal and rock man in front of me Tiny, so that way he does not hit as hard. Well, he gets one size smaller, so he'd be normal. Medium, but it still would not, not medium. like tiny, the official size. I'm making yeah. him smaller. I'm making okay. him Okay, you're making him one making size smaller. Him not okay. a large creature. Yeah. Constitution is his best stat, just so you know. He's a big dude. Pawn the best stat of everything that I go up against. Uh, what is the spell save DC? 15? No, he saves. 15. It's at the bottom there. Oh, yeah, he yeah. saves. Uh Yeah, you you bit you I pick can... your targets to do spells on cuz you're like I want to use this on this I want to use this spell that has a wisdom saving throw against another wizard. It's been a while. I haven't used this spell yet. I want to try it out. Worst target. Yeah. Yeah. You said that I could disengage left or right. right? You've already used your action. I already used my action. All right. I didn't think of, I didn't know if that was a movement action or an action action. Disengage right. uses your primary action. All right. Well, then that's my turn. I don't know what to say. I'm not, I'm not giving him an opportunity to attack. Okay. Uh, Monk, you're up. Damn. I'm just Monk now. All right. Yeah, you're uh, just Monk. You're just the Monk. I'm going to assist the burb. You, oh, yeah? Okay. And I'm just going to hit the thing. I will do this. What? That is a miss. No thwack. Uh, what? what? <laughs> 13? Yes. 13 is a miss. Yes. Dude, you rolled yeah. a 5. Wow. Try again. <laughs> Dude, we're oh, level 6. Oh. Of course, a 13 is a miss. Oh. Like, it, it's also a giant metal golem. 
uh, we're level seven. Oh, oh uh, yeah, sorry, yeah, yeah. fine. Yeah. Fuck. Well, I'll try it again. Level six. Miss. Oh. Yeah, uh, I need one. you to now that you've done now that you've done a critical <laughs> fail. Uh, I need you to roll me a d20. Roll a d20. Roll me a d20. Oh my god. Oh. oh my goodness. I was about to uh, say, oh man, you just snapped your fucking staff off on this thing. <laughs> Roll me a D2. Yeah. Heads flip, or tails? Flip coin, motherfucker. Goddamn. Am I calling heads or tails or no? Get a new character. You're, call, you're calling heads or tails. One is heads, two is tails. Tails. Okay. Okay. Uh. Okay. You're gonna just. You're just gonna. Your staff hits this thing, and reverber reverberates all of its all of the energy that you did against him into your hand, dealing three damage. Ah. Oh wow! Ow. If you oh. rolled a one. If you failed that, that 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 roll, your stick would have broken in half. Consider oh, yourself lucky. Man. I oh, God. consider yourself lucky. In one of the first sessions, I only failed one of the rolls, and my fucking flail got broken. <laughs> yeah, yep. the chain of his flail like, broke off immediately. I went with the probability because I rolled two ones on a row, so it was very unlikely I was going to roll three ones. Hey, you never know. I've seen it. I've seen it. I've that's, seen it. That's just not how math works, man. All right. You have a second. You do have a second attack. Oh, no, you already used it. Uh, uh, are I'm you going to do key points? Yeah. Patient defense. Patient defense. All right. Cool. All right. And that's your turn, I'm guessing, right? Well, yeah. See, it's how my hands are reverberating still. <laughs> So you're doing yeah, that yeah, top you know, cherry no. thing. Yeah, it kind of pulled, pulled the whole Looney Tunes idea. Oh shit, I can't stop shaking. The freaking machine didn't even notice. As you hit the monster, this I try I try to sing the same sound. So it's just like you just hit it and you just go and I'm just like, oh, <laughs> doesn't even fade it. Doesn't even, it. Doesn't even bother. Right. Doesn't even look in my direction. Like we're not even actually trying to kill the monsters. We're just making fun of the people who are failing. Everyone within this circle. That's including, uh, everyone inside this circle. That yeah. is including, uh, uh. So that includes you, you. You and you are uh, are hit with cloud of daggers. Cool. I thought it was smaller. I than thought that. that was a five by five. Yeah. It is a. It is. A, it, it is an upcasted, and it gets oh. bigger. Ah, ah that that up-casted. makes sense. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. Uh, I believe is at the beginning of our turn. Or uh, if we move into it's, it, you take damage now and then at the beginning of every turn after this turn that you're in, mm-hmm. that you're in, yeah. Oh, so I thought it it's, only, I thought it's it... only two d six. You know, I remember so... that I I remember that I cast cloud of dagger quite a few times, I, and every single time yeah. that I did it, it was when you start your turn in yeah. cloud of dagger. I was under the impression it was start of your turn also. Uh, I'll reread it. I I'll, I'll go get. Hey, uh, by the way, Jay, if you have it prepared still, just fucking pop the description up on the thing. Uh, you fill the air with spinning daggers at a cube of five feet per side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cast a spell. It increases the size and damage. A creature takes 44 slashing damage when it enters the spell or for the when it enters the spell for the first time or starts its turn there. Okay. Yeah, so and technically what... we have entered it right when it's cast. Yeah. So. Uh, I guess, yeah. This counts as entering it. Yeah. But I am lowering the damage from 
four D four to three D four. Because okay. I don't feel like killing you guys. Not yet. So the only reason Light we nerf. Discussed it was to, to hit more of us. Four D two yeah. D four. Yeah. Three D four. If I can pick up this fucking D4, why is it so goddamn slippery? Four. Stop soaking five, your six, die in soap. Five, six, seven, eight. You take eight damage. All of you take eight damage. Or Crisco, whichever one. What? What about Chris? Chris goes said, where? Do we have Crisco in Canada? Yes. yes. It's just called shortening here. Oh. It comes in a cube instead of a bucket. Oh. Yeah, I use it to make... Uh, I'm going to be using it to make Ichi his cookies. Aww. Because he misses, he misses those shortening cookies that much, he gets. Uh, sorry, well, how, many, how much should we take? Eight damage. Eight? Okay. Uh, if it matters, it is... I, if it matters, it's slashing damage. If you have a resistance to slashing damage. Nope. I'm not raging, so therefore I... Eh. Therefore not yet. Okay. Yep. Hey, can I can I move this? I wonder if I can move this. Yeah, if you click on the, the line itself. I'm trying or to. Or you can also click and drag and you can select. And that'll help you. I have been moved. Yeah, I'm just trying to see if I can move the... No, no, I can't. It won't let me. Huh. That is not where I was. That's not That's where, not where I was. Any of us were. Shit. <laughs> there you go. There we go. Move Gil over. There you go. No, it's okay. We're playing musical That's chairs. dead center of this thing. It was cast on me. Yeah. Well, it was cast on you because that's where the center of the four people are. Uh, and, uh, bonus action, it's going to, yeah, it's going to do that too. So it's going to, it's going to, ca uh, give bonus action, misty step and come over here. Step is a very loose word with that thing. Uh, There's more emphasis on the misty than the step, I think. Uh, Raven, give me a Constitution saving throw, please. Okay. Oh, you don't save. Mm. Uh, you get petrifying gaze. Lovely. First you were afraid. Now you're petrified. Petrified. Thinking how I could do? live without you by my side. And so many now. I got that song stuck in my head now. Fuck you. Fuck you. What does that do? A petrifying gaze is uh, a wow. spell that uh, once it is cast on a target, they are turned to stone unless they are cured. Using either lesser or greater restoration. Neither of which I have. Both of the uh, bo uh, the the spell also uh, allows them to take uh, attacks at advantage until they are, and once they have become unconscious, they are the spell is dropped and they are left unconscious on the ground. So we're essentially without a raven. I have been turned to stone. Hooray! Hey man, maybe you should lay it's, off it the is, but I, It is also concentration. I will say that. So, just so you know, same as Cloud as Daggers. Cloud Daggers is also concentration. So, I will tell quick, you that. Quick, nudge, nudge. Yes. Uh, again, Misty Step. They're going over here. It's a concentration spell, and that's why they're going the fuck over here. 
Of course. <laughs> uh, your turn starts. You're taking damage. I'm just going to do it this way. Slash roll 3d4. I, uh, I spelled slash Rolo. Hey. Rolo. I like that chocolate bar. Uh, Raven you can only damage. lives once? Cool. Uh, uh, Rolo is a really good chocolate bar. Do they have that in can- in the States? You guys have Rolo? Yes, yes we do. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We have Rolo. Okay, hey, listen, like there are Rolo's. some chocolate bars you guys don't have. You guys don't have coffee yeah, no. grits. No, no. So we we don't have it. It's not a chocolate bar. He calls, it's like a he calls it a chocolate wrap. bar, but they're like little tiny round things with caramel in them. Okay. okay. Yeah. Then, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah the same thing about. here. They're great. Okay. okay, so the first thing she's doing is channeling her divinity in Twilight Sanctuary, which is a 30-foot sphere centered on me, radius, of dim light. Uh, when my allies end their turn here, I can choose to grant them temporary hit points or end a status effect, which is not paralyzed, unfortunately. Okay, um, so there, there's the aura. I can yay. see it. They so can't when see you it. You guys end your you turn here. But, well, it is dim light. It, it's a, it's a, it's dim light. It's, it's considered dim light. So basically, yeah. we're now shrouded in shadow. Technically, I'm petrified, not paralyzed. But I don't know how well, yes. these two things are. I unfortunately I still hit. cannot do anything for that. The difference um, is more rocks. Does, Secondly, does, does, does it affect this guy at all? Is he an ally? No, I meant like, ally. does it do any damage or anything? Because no. he's concentrating. No, no, it doesn't do. It doesn't do damage. It doesn't affect their sight. It doesn't do anything to them. Okay. Um, it only affects me and people I want it to. Okay. Sweet. Um, so that was my action. Um, I am going to use my movement. That's not my movement. <laughs> that, to that, get the that. fuck out of this circle. Yeah, that's that. That sounds like a good plan there. <laughs> sounds like um, a good plan there, George. Let's see how it works out. <laughs> and then I'm going to cast spiritual weapon. Oh, fuck! Oh <laughs> no! I need a, I need two people now. <laughs> I uh, need two no, summons now. You need an. You need a flying sword. Is what you need. What do you want your no, weapon I need to be? A, a short spear, is what it the, will take the form of. Okay. Glowing sphere PNG. <laughs> oh fuck, I forgot the trick of how to how this works and <laughs> how does how does PNG work in that one? That one's glowing. That one that one works. I think that one will have no background. Oh, I need to add a spiritual I, I was lied to. That one had a background. Yes, yes. Two hours later. Mm, shut up. <laughs> Do I look like I know what a JPEG is? There we go. Okay. <clears throat> okay, there we go. I found you a glowing orb. Oh, there you go. Jesus. It's huge. Praise the sun. <laughs> I have found you a glowing orb. Place it where you want to place. I will give it to you. Give you control. I cannot so move it. Yeah, I know. I have to give you control. There you <laughs> there go. go. Now you can move it. Um, it will go right there. And okay. I have now put spiritual sphere oh. on my attack list. So I can do that. Yes, I'm going to have it go on your initiative, too. I'm not going to have it have its own oh, it, it, separate it, it, initiative. It works on my bonus action. Oh, okay. Because yeah. in Boulder's it Gate, it becomes its own action. fucking yeah. thing. So oh, that's attack. That's one of the changes they did when Boulder's Gate. Um, uh, which one are you attacking? Sorry, are you attacking the big guy or the little? Or, or, or are you attacking the the hag? That is a miss. That misses. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Great. Um, that's my turn. Okay. The hags are raven level, apparently. You would think that, but no, they're just 
they're just they're tagged. Just, oh, they're just and... leveled. They're leveled to your level. <laughs> oh, right. Um, I need to... How do I roll dice, guys? Slash roll. And then... Uh, like, 1d20. You know what I mean? Like... Yeah. He's rolled a D in roll twenty before. I, do, I roll real dice in when we game tie. So like slash roll and whatever tie. dice. Do I need a space? Yeah, space yeah. slash roll space and then the the dice combo. Okay, cool. So I gain thirteen temporary hit points. All right, sweet. Thank you. Matt, you're up. All right. So I cast. Uh, I cast. Actually, I was going to cast a transmuted fireball. I was going to oh. say, please, fireball. <laughs> they give you I, for it, I, but seriously. Fireball. I, as much as as much oh, as enemies. like I make the meme okay. of like every time that we play, I go fireball, please fireball. <laughs> Does anyone else have fire damage available? I also have fire bolt and fireball. I I can make my attacks magical for the purpose of overcoming resistances. Okay, so we have uh, lightning, uh, we have fire, so I'm gonna... Does anyone have frost damage? All I got is nature, radiant, and necrotic. Necrotic. <laughs> radiant, necrotic. I have frost I have a lot of radiant. My cantrips. All right, so my transmuted fireball is gonna be, is gonna be frost ball. Necrotic. Frost ball? Yeah, exactly. so instead of a giant so instead of a giant dome of flames in this spot, it's gonna be a giant dome of blizzard. This man's really dropping a freaking snowball on top of everyone. Welcome to being snowball. a transcribe wizard. I forgot to press the long rest. I hate it when my dad cleans my room because now I can't find my pen. You can't find anything. I can't. I. Oh God. All right. Wait. No, no, actually, I don't have to cast fireball. What is this? Twenty foot radius, forty foot high cylinder, centered on a point within range. A pinch. Does anyone else really <laughs> hate the fact that when you open Notepad, it opens the last thing you had in Notepad, which is very, very, very revealing if you have like if you're streaming. Yeah. That and you're streaming like, your desktop? That sounds like one note, not notepad, but okay. Notepad does that now in Windows 11. When you oh, open oh, notepad, yeah, yeah, it opens Windows the 11. exact last thing you did. Ah, well, see, that's the problem. Yeah. Windows 11. That's the problem. Yeah, well, they're, they're making that. it so you have to go to Windows 11 now. I have yet to go. I'm still on Windows 10. Anyway, I okay. So. Okay, yeah, so instead of casting Fireball, I can cast Ice Storm. Yeah. Which uh, everyone just uh, just uh, just to put it to you this way, Matt. Both of these guys over here are holding concentration on things. Yes. So they're going to get hit if I cast it here. If I cast it in this square, yeah. Then, then everything gets yeah, hit except yeah. for the party. Just making sure you're you're targeting the guys who are fucking with us currently. <laughs> yeah, so you so DM roll me DC sixteen dexterity saves for the entire army. The entire army. Okay. All right. Starting from the from up down and uh left right. That's what we're doing. Okay. The the top this guy here saves. Oh, and he has concentration too, right? Because yeah. he's still going to take damage because it's half damage? Yes. Okay. Oh my god. This is, this is, this is going to suck. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the, uh, I can't delete it, 
but the the drawing is gone. The cloud of daggers. Yeah. Oh, what if I just hit clear all drawings? There we go. Fuck it. Uh, cloud of daggers is gone. He only takes half damage, but. We'll, we'll deal yeah, with that later. Daggers, so that's... And the yeah. concentration on the uh, petrification. That, yes, what I'm doing now. Oh, you're rolling I'm that. doing okay. bottom one, bottom the bottom guy. He saves from the damage and saves with a natural 20 on the concentration. All right. So... All right, so that dude's razor sharp focused. Okay. So this guy next. Dexterity is not his forte, and he definitely does not save. 16, you said, right? Yeah. Uh, no, 12 does not make it. So, and he has no concentration, so that's fine. This guy here uh, saves. Uh, this guy saves. This guy saves. This guy, this guy's also getting hit? Yes. Okay. I want to make sure. Uh, does not save. And then that one saves. All right. So this guy and this guy are taking full damage. Everyone else is not. All right. Now I need to roll 2d8 for each for all of them and then 4d6 for all of them. Yes. So that's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, D, 8. No. No? You're you are... No? You, are roll, you are rolling 2, D, 8, and 4, D, 6. And then they are all what? just taking that damage. And they're all taking that. Yeah. Oh. They're not... Yeah. Okay. They will all take the exact same amount of damage. All right, okay, cool. So for the so that guy takes fourteen. That's the oh, blood calculator. My calculator crashed. Windows, uh. fuck off. That's a first. Matt, my guy. Some beautiful rolling from the fucking dice here. Jesus. Fucking Christ! Whoa. So all the ones this taking full damage real. just took. Oh my god! The guy, the ones taking full damage are taking thirty six. Yeah. And the ones taking half are thereby taking eighteen. Yeah. Okay. So now I just gotta do math. One second. Uh, That's a lot of max numbers there. That really was. Jesus. Uh I mean, you've been due for some good karma, for some good dice karma, so. Okay. All right. Damage calculated. Next. What are you doing now? Let's move these guys. Uh, I am going to uh, slide myself closer to this tree here <laughs> and end my turn. Uh, before okay. Before we change initiative, I have a question for you, uh, Overkill. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to roll the temporary hit points for everybody every round, or do you just want them to take what I rolled for me? Just take the ones that you rolled. Okay, so you gain 13 temporary hit points. Who? You. you. If you end your turn in this sphere, in this round, you gain 13 temporary hit points. Oh my goodness, I love this cleric already. <laughs> Look, I'm, I'm, I'm a wet paper bag. You don't understand how much this means to me. 
Wizard? Sorcerer. Oh, yeah, no, I, I get it. I'm the wizard. Ah. Uh... Still, we do have squishies that will very much appreciate the uh, temporary HP. Every round. Yeah, but does it not stack? Because temporary hit points don't typically stack. They'll still get new ones every round, even if it replaces what was already there. Oh man, it feels so good to have an actual dedicated healer. <laughs> I will just say, I, I a lot of built... just because I punch things more. <laughs> Shut up, Grok! You lost your cleric powers when your crystal broke. For like five. For like what half a session? I have them back. <laughs> yeah, and how many times do you use them? I mean, I to saved fair, your ass. He's a war cleric. So. <laughs> mm -hmm. I've saved yeah, your ass from have... dying a couple times, so. Yeah, and I've saved yours more. Yeah. Old I do not have shit, much guys. in the way of damage spells, but I've. I may be smaller, but my dick is bigger. <laughs> ladies, ladies, you're both pretty. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, well my vagina is deeper. So there. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. I don't even know what I'm listening to anymore. Welcome to my life. I don't even know what's <laughs> happening anymore. Right. It's Wait, what D &D. I hate it when mom and dad fight. <laughs> 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 Sorry, I'm looking up the spell. I'm looking up a spell. Okay. All right. Uh How close That that this this thing you have going on right now, it's concentration, correct? It's a channel divinity. Yeah, is that concentration? Red. What? Wait, sorry. What is? Is this channel, channel divinity, divinity thing you have going on? Is it concentration? It, does not say it requires concentration. Channel okay. divinity is just yeah. the general sweep all term for like the main cleric abilities. Uh, it's gonna cast Ray of Sickness on you. Okay. Oh my goodness. I cast uh, Counter Spell. Okay. Um, just so you know, it's casting it at fourth level, so you're gonna have to use a fourth level counter spell slot. That's fine. Okay, so mark that down that you've used a fourth level slot. Yep. Okay, just so you know. All right. Oh, fuck! I can't actually do that. Ah, oh. I only have one one fourth level slot, and I used it for Ice Storm. I'm sorry. Oh. You're getting hit with a ray of sickness. It's okay. Wait. Uh... Fucking Birdman! Counterspell this! Oh, okay. <laughs> Bored. <laughs> do the damn I'm thing. I'm stomach. Do the thing. Normally, I would be against the fact that you're giving orders on other people's oh. turns because that's metagaming, but... Show me! Sure. Do the thing! But also, it's kind of funny. That's why I'm just like, sure. Remember that, <laughs> that, just remember that you are marking down that you are using a fourth level spell slot. Oh, alright. I gotta redo that then, because... No, but because I'm casting this spell at fourth level, you have to counter spell at fourth level. Yeah. <laughs> that's actually very right. fair and balanced. Yeah, that's fair. All right. So it's almost like that's how the game, how it's played. Yeah. Okay. So I haven't read the book. The turn, the turn ends, right. and the hag, the the the, the hag the, the active god summons a fucking arrow. The hag moves. Uh, I'm going to have the hag move over here. Storm of arrows. What? You said the hag summoned an air arrow, so I said storm of arrows. Oh, I thought you I thought you were summoning storm of arrows. Is that your turn? 
What reaction is this? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> so, other hag uh, is going to cast Ray of Sickness at the level. Uh. I need you to. I need uh, CC. I need you to roll me a Constitution saving throw and beat a sixteen, please. I did not. You did not. I did not. And it is four d eight. Wow. Well, aren't I happy I have my temporary hit points to absorb, absorb some of that. 20 damage. Cool. So those are gone, and I take seven more. Seven damage. Uh, cool. Does your spirit weapon require concentration? It does not. Okay. No, sure. Then we so are I have in no the spirit, clear. I have no concentration spells up yet. Okay. We are in the clear. Third hag. Ray of sickness. This time on Matt. Yeah, I can't counter, counter, counter spell this. Uh, roll me a constitution save, DC 16. I love how they claim to use our bones for cooking, but they're making us all sick. Uh, that's have the you, best seasoning. Have you... Have you met a hag before? They're immune to disease anyway. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you take 10 damage. Uh, so, no, you don't. You take no damage. You have three temporary hit points left. Oh, God. I love this cleric. Oh. <laughs> uh, Mr. Otter, it is your turn. Careful, CC. You might end up with an uh, admirer. Uh, that makes okay. two because I you have a <laughs> Red has an admirer in the in the Friday campaign as yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no <laughs> it just sort of happens <laughs> oh, my... my wife makes it right. uh... well. I I have no need to move. They're within range. I has big sword. I do the barbarian thing of I rage. Yep. Now I. When shrink. do you get perpetual rage? Um. Yeah, isn't that your secret cap? You're always angry. <laughs> no. Uh yeah, perpetual rage is um. Not until like way later. I was gonna say I don't think that's level twenty. It's not level. I don't think it's level twenty. Oh, never ending rage, barbarian class form. It is a oh level twentieth level. Never mind. Yeah, it is. Yeah, that that that's the peak level thing. Is they can just yeah anytime they want. Yeah, Mm -hmm. never mind. (laughs) I thought it was like (laughs) twelve. Rage in sleep, just. Well, they would literally be doing the oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, roll, uh, roll your attack, sir. Right. And at advantage because oh. reckless. Yep. So I'm Can just you do reckless? Right in front of me. Can you do reckless and rage in the same turn? Because isn't reckless yes. a bonus action? No, reckless is uh, it. It's not it's a, a class feature. feature. It's it's a class feature. It's just oh, I, okay. I, I use a reckless attack to do this. Yeah. As a matter of fact, okay. here. Where is all it does is uh, give tw- you advantage. Twenty does hit. That is twenty slashing plus whatever bonuses he has. Yeah. No, it, this this is set up now, so it's all calculated. Oh, so in. it's built in. Okay. Yep. Including that radiant or. Uh... No, that I still have to roll. Because, thank you for reminding me, Divine Fury. Ooh. And with that, 
because fuck you, Hags. Radiant damage. 1d6 plus half your level. So 3. 1d6 plus 3. Uh, do me a favor. Yeah. Would you roll this? Roll 2d6, please. Oh. Oh, it's okay. weak to that. Okay. 2d6 plus half my barbarian level, so 3. three. Uh. That tells me what I need to cast. <laughs> oh. Well. I hate it here. <laughs> Oh, that's still twenty five damage altogether. Yep, and that's only um, one attack. Wait, I still have before, another attack. No, he has a before, reaction. Before you do that, here he comes the reaction thing where I had to roll a wisdom save. Probably, I uh, would like you to roll me a. Uh, actually, I need you to roll me a dexterity saving throw, please. Oh. No, wait, shit. Yes, um, dexterity. Okay, sure. I can no, do that. No, I need to hey, know. Danger sense. I get advantage on that. No, it don't. I don't think it's dexterity. Oh, it is a dexterity. Yep, dexterity. You have advantage. Let's go. <laughs> Dex save with advantage. Let's go. Definitely. You do not save. Uh. I D C. Oh. Oh goodness. Not. That much higher. Never fucking mind. Even with advantage, it's still shit. I can't win. I can't. Uh, you're only taking six damage. Hellish rebuke. Oh, that's what that. Okay. What type of damage is this? This is. Is it psychic? Fire. You've fire. point a finger momentarily so, uh, surrounded by hellish flames. It's fire damage. Fire damage. Damn. Not resist. It's actually to that. It's actually two d ten damage, but I didn't want to. I didn't did didn't did because they were casting it at a higher level, and I just don't feel like. I don't feel like doing a ton of damage. My my last soda. I'm not drinking anymore after this. God damn. Uh, is uh, you have another action, you have another turn, yeah, another attack, yeah, yep. Seventeen. Uh, that's a miss. Fuck my life, I quit. <laughs> don't do another, <laughs> please. I don't, I don't want, I don't need the stress, not today, please. Uh, yeah. Are you done? Do you have another anything? No, you said it's a miss. I don't have anything else. Okay. Because I used uh, my bonus action to rage. Yeah, you did, yeah. And then I did two attacks. Mm -hmm. One missed. Divine Fury only procs on the first attack that hits. Yeah. Alright, Ty, you're up. Right side, you get 13 temporary hit points. Oh yes, you do have thirteen temporary hit points. Let's go. So that that six damage you took didn't really matter. See, it's all, it's all, it's all good. So, and is Raven still yep. uh, petrified? Yep, that was the yeah. Raven is still petrified. That was the concentration so spell that didn't get uh, taken out. <laughs> yeah, so he needs a lesser or greater restoration then to get out. I am going to take a step forward. I'm going to cast lesser restoration. Oh, good. Yeah. I know that it says blinded, deafened, kind of... paralyzed, or poisoned, but this is the spell that the this uh this uh, stone gaze thing is a spell that I created. So okay. I, that's why it's not part of the list yeah. it's just a spell that i made it was a, it's yeah. a spell that i made for, to be like hey these are giant eyeballs and final fantasy characters have yeah. those petrifying gaze spells and i was like that's cool i'm gonna do this <laughs> so I'm excellent i am no longer tap, stone tap uh uh grok on his shoulder a little mushroom spawns and the petrification falls away Hurrah! And then 
I don't have any. Uh, that's an action. That's a minute. That's an action. And that's a bonus action, but I'm not going to be using my quarter step. So that's all I got right now. Okay. All right. You gain 13 hit points. Yay. And the hag. And the hag is... Hag is uh, in melee range. This is going to be awesome. I'm going to get hag maxing. Uh, did did you just say hag maxing? Yes. Are you are you watching V Shoujo VTubers all of a sudden? Like, I've been watching V Shoujo. Get out of here! I was watching the full. Get out of here, Michi Mokoko, whatever her name is. Michi 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 What? Making her heads up because they were hags, actual hags. It's a t- she named her stream this morning hag maxing. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, dragon, you're the only one that it can technically attack. Uh, yeah. So it's fine. gonna do, it's gonna do shocking grasp. Do you have weakness to the lightning by any chance? No. Being an otter. No, surprisingly. Oh, good. Uh, does a four hit your AC? No. <laughs> surprisingly. God, I would hope not. <laughs> Can you imagine? Uh, I wouldn't have. Second to. attack, it's gonna just try and kick you in the face. Uh huh. Does a sixteen hit your AC? I did give you plus three. Don't forget that. Oh, yeah. I haven't added that in. I'm so, pretty sure no. your AC is like 16 now, isn't it? Yeah. So, okay. Yeah. So, Defender wins. <laughs> well, I just right. updated it. So, yeah. I forgot you right. gave me that plus three. Golem. Uh. I mean. Oh, gonna... Ow. 30 feet, huh? And it's gonna hit his teammate, but sure. Uh, co- uh, it's gonna... What's it called again? Cone of Cold? No, because it's... it's... Talking Grass? A ray of Enfeeblement? Uh, I'm, I'm just naming off thing, uh, spells that go off in cones. Burning hands. Color spray. No. Uh, don't know what the name of the spell is, so I'm not going to cast it. I don't remember. I didn't write it down. Oh well. Enjoy One thing I forgot to write down. It was like it was. Beam. It was a lightning. It was a lightning spell, and I can't remember what it was. Chain the lightning? beam powers up. No, the chain lightning is a beam. Dies down because it forgets. <laughs> no, it's because speaking of chain lightning, it's going to cast chain lightning. Uh, it's going to jump to four targets. So here, 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 and here. Uh, okay. Cool. I need uh need you guys to roll me dexterity saving throws, please. DC sixteen. Uh, you are rolling with, yeah, you're rolling. Uh, does Danger Sense trigger multiple times? Danger uh, Sense. So. It's just a it, it's just a thing that happens. There you go. Okay. Then you're rolling with it. You are rolling with advantage. Okay. Oh, 
Uh, yeah, you save. Nat twenty on uh, the next save. Let's go. All right, Crow, you're taking you're taking six points of damage. Everyone else is taking three. Uh, because he's a because he's a bird. Does he take double damage? Because lightning. Type? Yeah. Well, I mean, he's a flying type. Flying types hmm. weak to electric, so. Yeah, right. I mean, it would make sense. He also, uh, he also, in that case, he'd also take double damage if someone threw a rock at him. I mean that too, but two birds, one stone, right? <laughs> <laughs> I I said that to a friend of mine, and he <laughs> he fucking. He was like, you've got to be kidding me! And I'm like, yes! Every move in Pokemon can be explained by a fucking pun! Yeah. Every same weakness is the... explained with a pun! It's the same with the spell components in D&D spells. Exactly! <laughs> the materi the material components... Just need a bean. The material components for Fireball are just the ingredients for a oh. Molotov cocktail. Yes. We've been over this. Any for your thoughts? Yeah. A uh, shatter. Mm. I want to read the compendium again. One second. Uh, Is it going to shatter Tempest's ribs? Is it a cone or is it it's a target? Point of my choice. Within range, I believe uh, it's a each creature in a ten foot radius. Yeah, circle. I've done that one. Uh, Me too. I've done it on myself. Oh, well, you want to do that? But yeah, Lovery still has trauma from that. And there it we go, right circle. here. That's everybody. There's a circle. Every... Yes, there is a circle one. That's actually oh. better to use. Wait, why is it ten feet then ten feet? Anyway, everyone gets hit. Everyone Minus tempest. It. It's like tempest. Uh, everyone but tempest. Sorry. Save. Constitution saving throw. Oh, I should be good at these. Oh, hey, I have a... Constitution oh, save. Uh, 3d8. 3d8. I made that one. All right. Yeah. You got a nat 20 on that one. Really? I'm so done. <laughs> uh, Kale and Raven and Marshall takes. 17 damage minus your temporary hit points. I don't have yet because I haven't had a turn since that. Yeah. How much, how much damage again? 17. 1 7. 17. Uh, everyone else oh, okay. takes. I think it's not even. I don't even think it counts as. A, no, it's not half. Oh, it's just you, you don't take damage. Us? You do not take damage. You do not take damage. Yay. Woohoo! Uh, and the last creature, uh, he's gonna fly to here, and Tempest, roll me a Constitution saving throw, please. Oh no! Of course, you pick Constitution. I mean, it's the same one as Raven had to roll. Yeah, it's not really picking, it's just what the spell. Swiggity sweat, you you're about buddy. to get hit. You got this, buddy. You save. Oh, damn. Uh. Yeah. No, second action. He's just gonna. He's just gonna. Uh, he's just gonna. He's just gonna do the thing with the magic missiles and hit you twice. God damn it! Uh, take four points of damage. 
Yeah, you'll live. So I've stopped trying to roll D4s when I need to roll a D4. What I'll do is I'll roll a D6, and if it's higher than a four, higher than a four, I'll re-roll it. <laughs> oh wow. It's impossible to pick up this D4. This D4 is like it's coated in fucking Teflon. It's impossible to lift. I hate D4s. They're slippery and terrible and horrible. And they get everywhere. Raven, it's your turn. All right. Um. Raven, so as you, uh, as the spell uh, from Ty hits you, uh, the stone that was surrounding your body begins to flake off and uh, the light begins to get back into your eyes. Mm-hmm. Yay! Gotcha, he knows baby. during Ty's turn, but yep. Ty's turn. Yeah, that well, yeah, but all the turn, every turn, yeah, it happens at the same, same time. time. So fair enough. Yeah. All right. Well, I was I was stoned for all of six seconds, but uh, yeah, I'm going to. Well, that it, it, they're all spellcasters except for the two with the three orbs. Uh, it's not a good. <laughs> Not hit here. Uh, uh, I'm gonna take a step forward in here. Yeah. Bonus action. Summon my echo here. Yeah. And I'm gonna swing from the echo on the uh, one in between us. Yep, that's advantage. Yep. <laughs> Uh, that's a hit. Eight yeah. Damage. Uh, unleash incarnation to attack from the front as well. Okay. That's a hit. Six. So that's good. Another eight damage. Yep. Sixteen total. Uh, Raven. Yep. Roll me a dexterity saving throw. All right, you save. Okay, so little pissed off from the things that have been happening so far. I'm going to pop Action Surge. Finally get it. (laughs) I haven't in a while. I have three different ways of attacking multiple times. He's actually doing it. He's kicking off. He's finally being John Dungeon Dragon. I'm (laughs) I'm aggravated at the fact that I just got turned to stone. So, yeah, uh, action surge, attacking from the Echo's uh, point again. That's advantage. Yep. Uh, yeah. 13 damage. Yeah. They grow up so fast. <laughs> that hag's still... Right, calm uh, down. Sta- that, that hag's still standing, or... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. That hag just, is still a hag. Just hagging. making sure that this is a spellcaster, and I've done like at least a half decent amount of damage. So I was. They're ninth sure. level. Oh. Okay. And I will hmm. crack a war priest to attack a second. Actually, no, I can't use war priest in this scenario, can I? You cannot use war priest again. It's a bonus action. Well, no, that's the yeah the war priest. I haven't used war priest this turn. But summoning the echo oh. is also a bonus action. So yeah, then no, yeah, you've already yeah, used. So the I, bonus I realized action. that like I haven't used War Priest yet. Wait, nope that that's a bonus. I've used a bonus this one. But I unleash incarnation. I can still do because that's not a that's part of my that's just doubling up my action. Yeah, you can do so unleash do, incarnation. So I'll, yeah, so I just attack normal from front side again from my regular body as well. And it's a crit. Yep. Roll double damage, please. 
Okay, so max damage <laughs> plus a roll plus savage attacks. Um, yeah, hang on. So max Holy damage. Holy said, nah, fam. This yeah. thing's still alive. <laughs> we about to change that, right? Raven, uh, you can do more than four damage. Yeah, fuck yeah, no, that's that's, that's <laughs> just that's just the max on the first attack. There's more, way more at damage added onto that. So, I mean, I you Doesn't also do matter. max damage plus yeah, your yeah, damage. that's what yeah, I mean. Dead. The max damage, the max damage that starts that <laughs> number is fourteen. So yes, uh, oh, yeah. that fucker just got overkill. <laughs> hey, uh, that's my name. <laughs> that is. Say that. That's copyrighted. Mm. Nah, you're that overtime. Uh, just so you know, specifically for your stream. Uh, just so you know, just for people who don't know, I count corpses as rough terrain. Just mm -hmm. so you know, so the corpses are there, and if you go to walk over them, they count as double movement action. On that, you guys trudge there. over the bodies. Okay. Yeah. Good to know. Oh, that's cool. All right, and I gain temporary hit points at the end of my turn, I guess. You gain, oh. yes, you gain thirteen temporary hit points. Okay. Yes. Okay, and that's my turn. Board. All right, I Board. am not so entirely stupid that I know not when to be. Cowardly, uh, I'm gonna take the disengage action, go over to here, and then after that, do I still have movement or is you it half your that? movement speed? Half my movement speed. That's great. I'm gonna fly 15 feet into the air. Sure. Uh, and that is Wait, my. Turn. Why does he only have half his movement speed? Doesn't disengage use use an action and half no. your movement speed? No, it's, it's just, just your action. Oh, okay. No, yes, full movement then. Well, I, I still. I, only that's the way I was taught. Feet. That's the way I was taught was that it's half your movement action, but that was also in third edition. I was so. gonna say it might have been in third edition, but not in fifth. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, now you're what thirty feet in the air. Fifteen. Fifty. No, because you you move full movement. You. Get I know. I only up. want to go fifteen. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. My All right. Full flight speed is like what fifty. So. Yeah, I could have gone twenty five if I wanted to, even with half. So, no, fifteen's good. Okay. Uh, a hit television show, Monk. All right, let me try this one more time with the fucking Gollum. I'm gonna laugh, you fucking crit fail again. I'm gonna be laughing so fucking hard. Yeah. <laughs> Pop, oh, right, pop. and at the end of that turn, I get 13 temporary hit points, right? Yes. yes. Okay. Oh, man. Fuck! I have more oh. hit, I have more regular hit points, or I have more uh, temporary hit oh, points man. than I do regular hit points right now. That is a miss. I will be trying Wait, to fix that. Wait, 20 is a miss? No, tw 12 is a miss. Oh, okay. I was about to say, I hope he's dead. 20! 20! Defender wins. Okay, now we know the giant constructs have uh, 20 AC. Got it. So, I have to hit it. Oh my god. You've got to roll 13 to... or higher. Jesus fuck. You have a plus 8. I don't want to hear it, alright? Yeah, your attack, your attack modifier is not bad in this scenario, so... These are also giant steel golems. Like, yeah, it, it shouldn't sense. be that hard to if hit they, if it's that big. Okay, you, you gotta it's under, not that it's you big, it's that it's tough. You gotta understand, AC isn't just dodging things, it's also armor preventing shit from actually hitting you. Yeah, it's like. toughness. So, in the case of a giant thing made of steel, it's not that it's dodging you, it's that just that you're not hitting the weak spots damage. between its armor. Yeah, like, essentially what you just did is you hit a car with a stick. Yeah, basically. <laughs> sure, if you got it in the right spot, that would do something, but... You gotta get the Patient headlights. defense. Patient defense. All right. <laughs> uh, okay. 
Help, I'm having fun drawing mushrooms. Mm. Oh, oh, not Jesus. what I wanted. Right? Oh, wait, I get uh, 13 points. Yeah. Sleepy otter. Yeah, yes, that's a sleepy the otter thing. Of the sleepy otter. Mm-hmm. Here? Yes. I, I have seen the photo with the sleepy otter in, in the antlers. Yes, no, one down. Okay. Uh, It you is... Talk. Going to... Cast lightning bolt, oh. and it's gonna ah. go like that. Uh, dexterity saving throws from the three of you, please. Uh, which three? The three who? Uh, these three here. Me oh. in red. And he also fails his dexterity saving throw. We all failed that. Maybe not CC. <laughs> uh, 17 seems to No, CC, CC saves. Things. Yeah. CC saves. That's a lot. Of, that's a lot more damage than I. Why is that third level? How is that third level? And I'm casting this at fourth level? That's ridiculous. It's 96 damage? That, yeah. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Fuck you. 46. When the DM realizes he may actually be trying to kill everyone. Uh you take six you take six damage. Uh the lightning bolt goes through you. Uh uh CC, you take three points of damage. Okay. Uh, bonus action. Uh... <laughs> Raven, roll me. Uh, was it wisdom again? What was it again? Yeah, roll me wisdom save. No, you don't save. My saves are not on point today. <laughs> Apparently. Oh, I forgot to add the plus three. Uh, so, no, you take six. You take, uh, uh, CC, you take six. Um, uh, everyone else takes so nine. Take the, nine. Yeah, nine. I forgot to add the plus three. I apologize. Mm. Uh, yeah, and um, as a uh, ray of light, a ray of uh, necrotic, I was going to say ray of light, but it's not ray of light. A ray of necrotic damage uh, rains down onto uh, Raven's head, dealing 11 damage. Oof. 11 hit points he won't be able to regain. Seven. That took partially the temporary ones. No, we're not doing the whole necrotic can't be healed thing and that's, anymore. That's only if the spell says it. It's if the spell says that it, that it uh, uh, okay. lowers your max HP. I... I moved gotcha. the wrong character, but there, I moved it and fixed it. Uh, and then now he... Uh, I go here. Yeah. Uh, Ray of Sickness. Uh... Whew. Ray of Sickness, second level. Ray of Flu. So, it's the second level. Does anyone want to cast Counter Spell? At what level is it? Second okay. level. Yeah, I'll do it. Alright, mark down that you've used a second level spell. I am using another second level spell. Are you going to count? You can't count. You can't counter that. Bird can. I mean, I can quicken counter spell. No, you cannot. You can't quicken the reaction. We talked about this. Aww. So, Bird, are you going to counter this? Yeah, sure. All right. Mark down that you've used a second level spell, and that is the end of his turn. 
second level. Counterspell is third level. Yeah, but this is a second level spell, so you're downcasting. All right. House rules it is. I'm I'm not about to have you guys use up all your spell slots. I will let you I will let you downcast certain spells to make the, your lives easier as the DM. Yeah, like I said, house rules. Got it. Yeah. I was gonna say okay. some DMs won't be that nice. Yeah, that one. Yeah, that one. I, I was about to say I really love this DM. Uh Cece, you're up. I cast Mass Healing Word at a fourth level, which lets me uh, 2d4 plus, give me a sec, where is my, so I do not know names yet. So, I mean, people I've seen taking damage, I believe, is this guy. Huh? Oh, yeah. If if you, if you I've seen yeah. you take damage, ping yourself. Or you can ping the people. Oh. Basically, everybody's taken at least one hit. Okay. I'm fine. I can choose. Mine was You're all, fine. uh, yeah, mine was all the temporary cool. points. Okay. Then everyone except you, because I can target up to six people. Um, is going to gain nine health. Counterspell. Thank you. <laughs> Counterspell. Only if you have a fourth level spell slot. He he has a fourth level spell slot. Okay. No Can I counterspell? Counter you cannot count. You've already used your counterspell. You've already yeah. used your reaction. Are you counterspelling me? Uh, I am, I am counterspelling you, yes. Yeah, dude up here is counterspelling you. Fucker. Um, but okay then. What happens when we're up against this many spellcasters? Okay then. Um, let's see. Believe me, that he's a my... lot more pissed about it than you are. <laughs> that was my bonus action. Um. This is why I hate spellcasters. Boy. I, I agree. This I'm is why I hate playing right? Dragon Ball. This is why I hate playing Dragon Ball Z. All right, you know what? She's gonna take her movement and cast Word of Radiance on this fucker. So he needs to give me a Constitution saving throw. No, not Constitution. Is that sarcastic? Seventeen. Or... That that makes it. Damn. Even with the minus one, okay. he makes it. Fine. Um. So that's that. But that's the end of my turn. So da, 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 let's redo this thing. That's okay. Now he has disadvantage on pretty much every spell because you're standing next to him. <laughs> <laughs> And then I can, <laughs> this round, everyone will gain 12 hit, temporary hit points. Right. On your, at the end I of know. your turn. I need yeah. to, like, cast, like, turn. I need to cast, like, fucking eight fireballs on you to knock this damn spell out. <laughs> That's so <laughs> fucked up. That's yeah. so fucked up. All it Look, is is temporary How much HP. damage everyone's been taking? <laughs> yeah. You're right. There's You're right. I'm not, I'm not points right. ain't lasting long. Overkill. Overkill. I am at 11 health. Let us <laughs> have this, please. <laughs> Just don't talk Listen, I'm the DM here. I'm you supposed to have... I'm allowed to have fun, too, you know? Yes. Yeah, yeah, we know. We know. Okay, no, don't worry, don't worry. You're allowed to have fun. You still suck. Uh, uh, that was a waste of my only fourth level spell slot. Hey, I, I burnt mine on the on the ice spell. That's okay, because cool. you also made him burn his. So fair. <laughs> mm. Okay. Uh, is that is that your turn? Yeah. Yeah. That. Okay. I, I used my bonus action. I used an action. 
I regained temporary hit points. Uh, what Matt, you're up. So how wonderful is it that Fireball is a third level spell? That's pretty cool. I mean, you can upcast it, just so you know. I don't have the spell slot. I know, but I'm just saying, it is a third level spell, but it's way better at fifth level. <laughs> so I cast it's also way better fire. at ninth level. So I cast no, because at ninth level you have ray, you have uh, disintegration ray. So I cast, so I cast heightened fireball. Ooh. Heightened fireball. How many uh, sorcery slots you got left? That this one costs three and transmitter yeah. costs two. At my twenty, drops me down to. Yeah, I have enough to do this. I have, I'll have like two two points left. Okay. Sweet. Uh, what uh, what bonus does this do? Uh, it's just it's just they roll at disadvantage. They roll at disadvantage. So it's dexterity save at disadvantage. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck you. You rolled a natural twenty. Where's this fireball sent? Are you fucking kidding me? Did you roll a two nat twenties? I rolled a nat twenty and then a nat one. Oh. <laughs> oh. The, the duality. <laughs> the duality of man. This dice is going into jail. Perfectly balanced. Anyway, this whole thing. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, so roll your 8d6 damage. Yeah. On the whole, on the whole six, group surrounding this area, right? Uh, yeah. Yes. No, it says target takes 8d6 damage. Pretty decent. Okay. It's a decent fire. Uh, what creatures are being hit? Because there are some creatures that are not anywhere near that. Funny foot spear. Yeah, because I'm like, this creature is not getting hit if this creature is getting hit. Yeah. So you have to choose where you're putting this. Yeah, so you don't want to do that because you're going to hit dragon and. Oh, you could do that. Yeah, you could do that. No, you're still hitting dragon, by the way. It's fine. Uh, you're, you're, gonna, you're fine you're, with taking 31 damage? 16 at, dis at disadvantage. <clears throat> yeah. Mine, mine will fucking even out because danger sense. I know you're casting it. Well, yeah, yeah fair enough. Like, like, I mean, if you advantage. fail, you're taking thirty-one damage. Is what I'm saying. Yeah, I'll be fine. Uh, sure, I guess. Uh, All right, okay. I'll be fine. So normal roll dexterity. Uh, spell save DC. Defender wins. So dragon wins. Yes, defender. Dragon is yes, defending. Defender wins. Yes. Okay. So you take half of thirty-one. I'll take fifteen. Mm, fifteen. Yes. All right. So I'm taking three points of damage. There goes the temp HP. Yes. That you will immediately regain upon the end of your turn. Uh. Okay. Temp HP doesn't stack, right? No, no you're basically dead. Basically, what you'll get from this replaces what you have. You're dead. I don't remember. Did this one take damage? I know this one did. They all take damage. No, no, no. It it before this. Did they take uh, did this one take damage? This one did. This this one did. Okay. Uh, then 31. Yeah, okay. All right. Cool. Uh... All right. 
uh, remove him from the initiative order. Remove him from the initiative. See, I told you, I'd be fine. <laughs> Look, I don't want to burn my friends. It's fine. <laughs> Please remove him from the initiative order. I the math was mathing. All right, is that your turn? Uh, yeah, I didn't quicken it, so I'm just gonna. You can do quicken on something else that makes quicken. Like, I, I, that's three sorcery oh, points, and I only have two. Oh, yeah, and it would only be if it was a cantrip. Could yeah, like I was saying, like, like quicken firebolt is firebolt. a cantrip. Yeah, but I, again, I don't have. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I just have to just do a quick move and then end my turn so I can reach, so I can get my nice healing shield. Oh, shit. How many people were hit by Ray of Feeblement? I don't remember. Uh, Ray of Sickness, sorry. How many people were hit by Ray of Sickness? I don't know. I got, I got, I got hit by some Ray of Sickness. Three different people. About it. I wasn't paying attention. I should have, because you're also poisoned until the end of the turn. Oh, you son of a bitch! Isn't that only if it, if it, if you fail? Mm -hmm. Uh, on a failed save, it is also poisoned at the end of your turn. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Didn't it just, get counterspelled? I, no, because I've used I've used it more times than you guys have counterspelled it because it was a fourth yeah. level spell. Yeah. Uh, all right, your turn is done. The other hag is pissed off that the other hags have died. Uh, would you say that she's hagged off? Yeah, she's hagged off. Uh, right, okay, well, well, she has one more fourth level spot left, so fuck it. Uh, ray of sickness on four targets. Instead of one on each target. Uh, okay. So this is going to get hit. 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 Four targets. What? 2D. No, 1D. What is it? 1d8? Yeah, 1d8 per person. I need you to roll me a... Thank you for the follow. Constitution That's saving me. throw. I, I, I figured... <laughs> Constitution <laughs> save. Yeah. Who's that? Oh, that? That's, yeah. <laughs> Dragon saves. Are, I was looking at my much? computer. Did I, did I get hit by that? Uh, uh No. Okay. No, you did not. Okay. Raven, did you have to roll dexterity save on your on your mirror image? Uh depends. Is there I I, I can. Uh is there a half damage involved even if I succeed? Oh no, yeah, there is. Yeah, it just dies. Yeah, then right. it doesn't matter because I it only has one HP. So Yeah. It it it's just going away regardless for now. Okay. It's fine. This uh, and roll side. me a I need you to roll me a constitution save, and same for you, Cece. Okay. And this time... Stats, but I don't have... I don't have efficiency. Apparently she's feeling she's fine Damn today. It. Yeah, you, you, you're, you're, you're good. Poison? All right. <laughs> I, on the other way. hand. Uh, two I points think. to Raven. Seven points to... Oh, no, Dragon takes half. So, I don't know, three, I guess? Three. And... CC takes three. Uh, you take two. Okay. Uh, you are now Raven. You are poisoned. Lovely. Uh, so you're gonna take one d six damage at the end of your next turn. Uh, 
turn, at the end of your turn. Hmm. Unless someone cures you of poisoning. Uh, Gilbert, you're up. Mm hmm. Bibbidi bibbidi boo up. Bibbidi bibbidi boo up. Oh. Well. Not much I could do besides maybe take a step to the left and then start swinging on this fucking construct. Ugh. Highest drawings are always good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they are. I had so, fun. I, I have fun with that idea. Just like I just love the idea of fucking Jazal going feral. Mushrooms. Let me see this again. That is a superhero pose if I've ever seen one. <laughs> Out of the knees. Superhero landing. You know that's really tough uh, on the knees. Really tough on the knees. All right. Swing recklessly. I'm already raging. Did, did your rage? No, because you've you've been hit. Never mind. Your rage yeah. didn't wear off. Never mind. <sighs> I'm a tired boy. Same. And I have work tomorrow. Same. I have an early am, tomorrow. I am not getting more than five hours of sleep tonight. Okay. So... Yeah, we're, we're just gonna done. swing on the fucking construct, because there ain't nothing else I can fucking do at the moment. So... Reckless... 19 misses. And the wing again. There you go, crit. Ooh. Oh, yeah, 15 plus 14. Woo. All right. Oh, wait. There's also, Divine Fury. Because <laughs> that that attack hit, the other one missed. Bippity bobbity boo up. Alright, so one D six plus three. And it's gonna be radiant damage. It's gonna be May. So. There you go. Next damage. It dies! Hey! Well. Yeah! <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. Let's go. Just imagine fucking a wing and the fucking grace are just bouncing back. So I just fucking use that momentum and swing it back the other way and fucking take it down. All right. And that's your turn? Yeah. All right. Ty, you're up. Oh, don't okay. forget your temp health. Um... Oh, yeah. Don't forget your temporary health. You don't add them together, by the way. You just gotta. Yes, yeah, so I'm aware. Okay. And it was a 12, 12. round, I believe. Yep, 12. Still those two in the background. <gasps> I see something. Actually. Actually. Oh, 
Oh, I haven't been doing something. Oh, yeah? What have you forgot? Oh, so there's a certain thing that's kind of a passive ability. Halo of Spores. Starting at second level, you are surrounded by invisible, uh, invisible necrotic spores that are harmless until you unleash them on a creature nearby. When a creature you see moves into a space within 10 feet of you or starts its turn there, you can your use your reaction to deal 1d4 necrotic damage to that creature unless it succeeds a constitution savings throw against your spell save DC. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's 1d6. It's it's 1d6 at 6th level. Um. What? That won't happen until that guy's turn. If he stays... Well, no, not at the start of his turn. Uh, da, da, that being... Okay, that's not what I want. Right, the one that I'm thinking of, I don't get till later. Eh. Twenty feet, <sighs> ten feet, sixty foot radius. Miniature tool, spherical. Oh. Oh, yeah, that would get. Hmm. Let me zoom out here. God damn. Big fucking circle. It's a 60 foot radius. Perfect. Uh, okay, wait. Let me just say this to you right now. There are a lot of wildlife in this fucking forest. What are you doing? What is the genocide? Sounds like we'll have dinner for the next week or more. Yeah. What is this genocide you're doing? It's a I storm. <laughs> it is a natural storm. Grisol's a, Grisol's a, Grisol's a spore storm. druid. They speak for the trees, not the animals. Fuck. Uh, DC Look, 11 dexterity save? Uh, it's not 11. It's, it's uh, that, I don't know why that says 11. It's 15. Okay, well, save. Save. And there's one more, the hag? Not save. Mm -hmm. Uh. So the ones that save, it was just those three. If it's uh, I can't hear you three. anymore because Tempest decided to play the loudest sound effect in my stream. God damn it, Tempest! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Tempest. Trying to do damage. Well, he's dead. Yeah, and it's oh, uh, these guys are also music. dead. Just oh. also like I'm fucking tired of this. I feel that yeah, they're also they're also dead. <laughs> Brock, uh, one hundred percent during the last one. turn, just said fuck it. <laughs> yeah, it just went off on the hag. <laughs> They've got some fucking repressed emotions right now, right? <laughs> <laughs> I love one of their friends Wait, is dead. They're not um, dead. They got this new person? Yeah. One, okay. one, one of our friend we one of our friends just fucking died. We're we getting For uh getting... shits and giggles, Ty, I need you to roll me five D one hundreds. Oh my god. Two hundred and fifty five woodland creatures are now dead. That's not how many would be there except for like maybe <laughs> bugs. Yeah. Bugs and bugs. Uh, that's, 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 creature. that's actually not too terrible because there's a lot of bugs. I hit an anthill. <laughs> you got a 69. <laughs> hey. 
Oh, come on, let me put the 69 on screen. I see it. Come on. There it is. Oh, lightning really that destructive? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty bad. Like, that you can't it, it, control it, And it just it gets worse. Well, and like, I you thought are that kind was of calling upon the wrath of Zeus, there. so. That's the exact. Uh, oh, that is 10 feet tall. Also, it's a concentration. It's got a concentration. You can see. You cast the spell, choose a point, consuming cloud. Yeah, I'm going to say over the, the, the 255 creatures that die are over the course of the next 10 minutes. Yeah, that sounds better. <laughs> I was going to say, I, I would, seeing that the things that I'm targeting are dead, I wouldn't be holding the concentration. That's fair. I, I would willingly drop it. Because I'm not about to do more damage to nature than I need to. Yeah. That one. Uh, oh, are you done your turn? Yes, that's the end of my turn. Okay. Boop. Uh... I just want to point out that the three, if three people who were, like, really hmm. close to Care, all decided, we're fucking done, and started beating the shit out of everything. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so that's it. Yeah, we're all just like, nah, we're not happy today. You, you're 15 <laughs> feet in the air, right? You said? It is what he said, yes. yes. Okay. This will still hit you, the 20-foot cone. 20-foot blast radius. Uh, yep. This will hit yep, yep. literally everybody. Sure will. Uh, uh, it's self your temporary hit point. Oh, oh yes, right. it is self destructing. Uh, everybody. Can I counterspell the self destruct? No, you cannot. This no, is a not a spell. This is this is this is the thing that it can do. It's like a. It's like it's like rock. Action. Summoning his thing. It's just, yeah. Dex mm -hmm. save. Uh, yes, everyone dex save. That, 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 yeah. Advantage? You have right. advantage. Danger sense advantage. Dex save. Let's go! You don't have advantage, Matt, but that's fine. 21 Doesn't 21. Rolled the same thing twice. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I, I'm also in that boat, Ty. Uh, yes, I regret. I I regret to inform you that the DC save was 25. Oh shit! Did Mr. Eyeball roll a dexterity too? Yeah, he also failed. I got hit. He got hit too. Yeah, he, he, sure did. He failed. He he failed. I, uh, I, so he crawl curls up into a small ball. And turn, he starts to glow bright orange, and explodes, launching cool. rocks in every direction at extremely fast speeds, like bullet speed. He dies, and so does the other hit. guy. So combat's over. Yeah, but there's some of us right next to him. Uh, yeah, especially with it being. 10 d6 damage. Jesus. So. Uh, 39 damage oh, total. Nice knowing, okay. Oh, let me, take half of let that. me mask this real quick. You're, you're not dead. Because okay, that's not triple, double your yeah. HP. Yeah, down. HP total. No down. Just down. Uh, 13 down. 20. Ow. Bam. One, two. I, I don't, I don't think the uh, my my nat twenty on the save meant anything. So no, because saves are not like yeah. that. Sad. All right, I'm at negative fifteen health. You see, bird boy fall out of the sky. Yeah. Do you... Now I'm gonna give Tempest if he's still up. After taking 39 damage. 18 because of the uh, evasion. 
Oh yeah. Oh, realistically, so, that should take massive damage, and I just die, die. N- no, because you don't. Because that's not how that works. Anyway, Wait, are you down? Your health count. It has to be double your your total health. So, I'm still up. Okay, then you. I'll give you a chance to catch board. Catch board. Yes. What am I rolling for this one? Uh, just roll dex, not a save, just dex. Okay. Yeah, you catch him. Uh, what was the damage roll on that again? Sorry, I looked away for a second. 39. 39? Oh, well, that, yes. that just popped my relentless endurance. I have one HP left. Ooh. All right, cool. and I'm now com- oh, combat is now over. And, and also, at the same time, so is today's session. Yep. Woo. <laughs> All right. So a longer one today. A little bit of a longer session. Uh, thank you guys for watching today's episode. If you liked it, give it a like. Check out the Twitch channels of the uh, other of my other players below, and uh, yeah, say and uh, leave a nice comment to our new member. My wife. Woo. Bye, I love you. <laughs> All right, there we go. Welcome to Evan, him, by the way. I fucking love Evan so much. I have <sighs> work tomorrow. I am not going to be getting any more than five hours of sleep. Guaranteed. Hey, goodbye. Uh, go, go to bed. Yeah, so yeah I, I got to go yeah. too. Okay, See you goodbye. later, guys. Bye. Good night, guys. I know you've had a question <gasps> for me. Yes. Uh. Yeah, give me a second. I'm going to move you down to another yeah. channel. Okay, let's see. Who is rateable right now? Uh. Uh, I'm gonna clock off a two. I need All to right. go think about lying to bed. Yeah. It was fun. It was. Have a good night. You too. Sierra's those talks are... you know what I don't fucking know Sierra man all righty Thank you very much, everybody. I will be back, hopefully, tomorrow night for Baldur's Gate with Ichi and uh, Overkill and Chuck. Uh, may have, may end up working late. We'll find out. Uh, shouldn't be, but you never know with these things. Anyways, we're going to raid off to Sierra Dawn right now, currently uh, streaming... Team fight tactics, which I know she's been doing commentary for for a while. So I will talk to you again tomorrow, hopefully. So thank you very much for coming out. It's been fun. I'll see you again tomorrow night, if not then Tuesday for probably Space Marines. We'll see. Thank you very much for coming. Peace. Mm-hmm.